Hi, Hi everyone. Now. I'm, I'm Garrett. I'm Ronnie. We are Garon Stitchery. The house of Garon Totten Bags. Yay, we got it. <laughs> and now we are doing the stitching. stitchers, the uh, stitching in the wall. Yep. Retreat. For today, yep. then we go back to our original uniform. uniform. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So um, thank you guys for coming back or stopping in for the first time. Yes. Uh, we are a floss tube channel about cross stitch. Uh, we are cross stitches ourselves, and um, we own a cross stitch store. So we have a little bit of, um, it's an online shop. So it's a little bit of a different perspective. So it's either, it's what we stitch and then there's also stuff what's new in the in the shop, what we show. So um, hopefully you'll enjoy the wide variety of different items that, yeah. we, that we have. If you're ready, please take a few minutes, go for your drink, because I'm thinking this video go be wild. Wow, <laughs> That's okay. They can pause it and stop it and start it and take breaks because we'll be stopping and starting while we're filming. Yes, we have to do, we go do the original video uh -huh. and there we go through the station in the wall. Yep. And then uh, we'll keep going and then we'll have stuff at the end. Uh, little videos we did at the stitching in the wild um little photos yes oh my god i'm already getting choked up <laughs> <laughs> all right so first off we would like to do our shout outs that we do to fellow floss tubers that tagged us in their video yes. we are very appreciated to the floss tube universe um it's it's an amazing place that you, if you want to just sit in your home and, and watch videos and see what people are stitching that's it. That's yeah. what it is. So first, we would like to thank the 614 Stitcher, uh, Candy Carr. Thank you so much thank for shouting us out. And thank you for coming to the retreat. And next, we would like to thank uh, Jack's Creative Inspirations. Uh, that's Jackie. Jackie, Jackie thank, thank you thank for you so the much. shout out. And thank you for coming to the retreat. Yes. <laughs> and, well, I'm seeing a trend here, people. <laughs> uh, next um, is uh, Half Stitch Cross Stitch. And that's Dina. And she... Thank you, Dina, for coming to the retreat and spending time with us. It's very and, well appreciated. Yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. And then finally, but not the least, uh, Seizook Stitch, uh, Carolyn. Um, she was also at the retreat as well. So what I enjoy about watching their videos in this last group of videos was that they, they did their normal video and then they also did a wrap up of their, per, their experience and their perspective at Stitching the Wild. So it's a very a uh, fun way of um, of looking at things. I, I do know when uh, I was watching Jackie's, Jack's Creative Inspirations, it was kind of funny because she brought up about doing the next next year retreat. And I didn't really think about it because people were asking me all things all the time. So apparently I changed my phases from day one, which was Thursday, to day to the last day, which was Sunday. So I thought it was kind of cute. She said, so she asked me on Thursday and I said, I don't know, let's just see it through today. <laughs> Yeah, we don't know. Yeah, and then Friday it was like, maybe, we'll see. And then Saturday was like, this is pretty cool. This is fun. Oh, we'll look at it. And then Sunday was, okay, see you guys next yeah. year. <laughs> so it's a very cool, and, and that's how mentally we went through the whole weekend. We yeah. were we were scared to death, and then we were super happy. <laughs> yeah, like the week before I was super, super, super stressed. Yeah. The stress was killing me, the you know, but it, but anyway, we going back to the stitching in the wild and after the store. Yeah, so yes. we'll, we'll come back to stitching in the wild in a few minutes. Yes. yes. All right. So first, um, we would like to um, go through our normal video of. Uh, do you have any finishes? No, even crosses. <laughs> uh, I have some finishes that we will show <laughs> relation to the stitching in the wild. As many of you may have uh, given me thumbs down about or gave me uh, some nice comments about. Uh, a few weeks ago on the video, I showed my finishes, but I had a piece of paper in front of them so you couldn't really see them. So we will be removing the piece of paper so you can see the fully finished um, exclusives that we um, couldn't show until after the retreat. Yeah. I'm uh, I noticed the last, the last week, mm -hmm. the week before last, because I was too stressed. Mm -hmm. And there, in the retreat, I can Too stitch. hyper. I'm trying, but 
I don't have too much adrenaline. I can't miss this. And I, and I think uh, when I show you what I did before the retreat, during the retreat, and after the retreat, you'll see I was the same way. Yeah. And this week, I cannot stitch because we have tons of work. Mm -hmm. Because we have to put it stuff on the website back. And it's, okay. it's crazy. All right. So let me show you my whip. Yeah. Before we go to another subject. <laughs> All right. So I worked on, I have to stand up here. So I worked on the center block there. I started on the witch. Um, this, before I went to the stitching in the wild on that Mon that Sunday, I did the pumpkin. So I stitched the pumpkin. <laughs> and then for the, uh, from, from Monday to Sunday, Monday, actually Monday to Monday, I stitched the black cat. <laughs> so a week it took me a week to stitch the cat and then uh tuesday to today so like four, the next four days i stitched the witch and part of the cauldron so that is um where i'm at on halloween and hawkwin hollow by carriage house samplings all right i really love this piece and i'm doing it with um the npi silks and i'm stitching it on 32 count um colonial parchment by fabrics by stephanie so um, that's all I have to show up my stitching. But I really enjoy this piece. So this piece I, I stitch on from the 15th of the month to the end of the month every month. And then uh, when the first of the month comes, I pick up the um, designer focus. Yes. which um, It's almost around the corner. Yeah. And, and because next video will be filmed on the second uh, we will show the we'll show the designer focus stuff on that video because if we did try to squeeze that into here, you guys would be like, "What they say?" There was so much I couldn't absorb it all, <laughs> and I understand that, so I want to piece yeah. it out. So yeah. um, June's designer focus is cottage garden samplings, and I believe you guys all know they've got some great series out there that are any number of projects to pick up and start or or to the kid up or anything so they've got some great ones uh coming so that being said are we ready to see what's new in the shop what is new and what is comeback let me move this thing out of the way okay the new is sharps okay it's handsome design right Could be, uh, uh, so we'll be tagging back and forth a little bit on the on the retreat so hands-on design had a trunk show at the retreat and these are um, some of the charts after the retreat that we decided to keep for the shop. So these are going to be, these are all in the website. So this, yeah. right. sorry so, for that. Nice technical difference. Now that you guys can see us up close. <laughs> so we'll try not to bounce the table too much. Oh, 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 <laughs> that's him. <laughs> all right. So, so uh, the first chart we'd like to show is Memorial Day. These are not new charts. These are either back in the stock or new to us, or maybe you, you haven't seen them yet. So these are really cool things. This is what I really enjoyed about the trunk show. So this is Memorial Day by Hands On Design. Great piece for the next coming weekend. If you wanted to start something, this would be a great one. And, that one. All right, and now the next one is, if you guys remember, Stitch Some Happy came out. And for the retreat pieces, Kathy had, had added, I think actually the whole chart, I think it has a little t plus tag. Yes. in there so this is stitched i'm happy i saw this stitched i saw these models stitched up they are so cute i mean models sell models make you want to stitch everything in the world you guys know what i mean so the next one here is stitching by the sea okay it's a little cute piece and i was like wow that's kind of special all right Okay, I like this one. This one is the Good Ship Sampler. It's, uh, there are good ships and wood, and wood ships and ships that sail the sea, but the best ships are friendships. May they always be. This is like a, per this is a perfect piece to do a stitch along with a group of friends. It's called Good Ship Sampler. Uh, at the retreat, uh, Kathy had sent us this model. So there's actually two patterns in there. So that one's pretty cool too. I like that one. And next one is uh, the Autumn Basket. These are a grouping of three pillows that you would stitch the centerpiece and then you would get the quilting fabrics to um, finish the pillows off. It's a great series. Here's the winter one. This is the summer. Oh, summer. So this, this is, is autumn summer. and summer. 
So don't they beautiful? I mean, you just pop them in and out for your seasons. Yeah. Um, Stitchers love doing seasons. <laughs> and this is Coastal Holiday. I'm actually stitching this one. I, I'm this one. I'm working on the box first. But I, when I saw these in person, I said, "Oh wow! I need. I should have started with those. Those are so cute." But I still love the box. This is beach, please. This one was very deceiving. I've always thought this was like a little pin pillow. And I don't know. I watched Kathy's video, so I should know how big it is. Because when she pulls out the pillow, it's a pretty good sized pillow. <laughs> but this is so cute. It's like beach, please. And she also has an alternate where you do it on paper. And you do it like a little um, shadow box thing. But I, I love the pillow. I think the pillow is so cute. Tomato, tomato. Mm -hmm. oh. This is uh, tomato, tomato. And it's the little little tray. You stitch the little tray and then you stitch the little tomato. Or is that a tomato? I don't know. You decide. Okay. And then we have... She, she sent us a lot of sea-based um, uh, designs for the trunk show because we were in Florida for the retreat. Mm -hmm. So you'll, you'll feel like, wow, this is very... Um, Oceany. So this is wild salt air. And it's the design, it comes with, it's that design. And then there's the pattern to do these other three little designs. So there's like four designs in this little, little chart. More beach. Yep. And then more beach. What do we, <laughs> beach please. Uh, and now we're getting down to more beach. So you get the two cute patterns there. Those are these ones. Uh -huh, okay, uh -huh. so this one right here, she's got a great series. It's, it's uh, that's on the edge board. It should show your board there. So that's the piece there. So you yeah. you put it together and you paint it. And then- I'm thinking it's coming paint. Mm -hmm. This one is paint black. Really? Yes. I shall see. Uh, I don't think so. I think they're laser cut, it's burnt. Well, we will see. Who wins, Gary or Ronnie? Gary Weed. It's just the edge. <laughs> it's the edge because it's laser cut. Oh, so okay. Yeah. All right. So so you will yeah. still have to do some painting or find a friend like yeah. I do. But this is so this is the the first um there's a whole we, Kathy has a whole series of designs that fit on the board. One day's day. And then she shows where you put magnets on the back of them. They're all yeah. in the basket. Magnets on the back of them and then magnets on here, and then you pop them in and out. So this yep. this one right here, Mad for Plaid, comes with the four seasons, which is cute. And and now we're doing fourth block party for the block party. So you're coming with a little tile for the cushions. Yeah. So you could either finish it as this piece, or you could do just the side like I did for the seventeenth, and make it a, a banner, um, a long skinny finish, which is kind of fun. And this is oh oh say can you see? So it's the drum it's and the little pinto. With well, the velveteen wait. for the top or the back of the pillow. So you can either put it on the top or yeah. the back. So you have to choose. It's only enough yeah. to do one or the other. Yeah. And the velveteen is for another girl. Lady, Lady dot. dot creates. Yeah. So you can always get more of it. All right. Now this is the next series. This is an older series from Kathy. So you, you might not have seen this for a while. This is To the Beach. <laughs> he got a couple of them all the same. So this is Surf Life. And we gotta be careful because the chart's on the back of it. It's a oh, single thing. Sorry. So this is Surf Life. All right, and then we have Flock Together. So we have Flock Together here. I love this. This one's cute. This one, uh, you could do by itself. But I can imagine you can get one of those windows and you could stitch all these, they're all the same size and put them in one of those window, like a window pane. And this is like, oh, well. And then like, cause if it's like a six panel window pane, you got five panels here. And the sixth one, you could put the the time you went on a vacation or stitching in the wild or something like that. So this is uh, no, no beach time, on beach time. I'm reading it backwards <laughs> on beach time. And the last one and is- And here too. I know, I was trying to read it in the front. Uh, a little cottage. Okay, and then- Resting. Resting stitch, beach, resting beach face. Say <laughs> so that very clear. And this, um, okay. when I saw the model, 
it is small enough. It's the right size. You can also pop, pop it on here. So she's got a, a couple of them that you could do that with. So you could still mm -hmm. stick it on that. Yes. And then this next one here is a Merry Christ uh, Classic Christmas. Classic Christmas. And it is also small enough to put on here. So you could paint this red or, or any other color you wanted to to, to be um, to go with this piece. <coughs> so that's what I'm liking about these smaller pieces of Kathy's. And this is an amazing finished piece. Yeah, like these ones too, but we had the wood for that. There's 141. Everything's reachable in this shop. Well, relatively. So this is the finishing boards for this these pieces, these next room pieces. Yeah. There are five of them in the series. There's actually six. There's a sixth one that is um I that's have four here. Four? Probably the other one is mixed somewhere okay. over yeah. here. There, so there's five total. Um, the sixth one is a an, uh, PDF download from Kathy Haberman's site. And the money for that goes to her special Olympics charity. So mm -hmm. that's why we are happy as a shop to support her charity. So I will be going out and buying one for myself mm -hmm. to make sure I give back to Kathy and her charity. Yes. And this is a uh, day at the beach. This goes on the on the edge board. See how it's see how it's like decorated, so you can add a bunch of little trinkets. You could even do like if you picked up some little souvenirs while you're yeah. traveling. And there is here's here's the fourth, fourth of, of July. Fourth of July. It's a happy birthday. I like this one myself because in my mind, I'm thinking you could put this up for the whole month of your birthday because I celebrate the whole month, and then every day your significant other. <clears throat> Ronnie could put a gift in there for you to open up every day, like a ring one day, a watch one day, a diamond one day. You know, all those little trinkets that go in a little small box. Yeah. It's crazy. <laughs> hey, it's a thought. Especially jewelry. He don't like jewelry. <laughs> no, because my hands, everything swells. He over the moon our wedding ring. Every, what is it? It's laying next to my stitching <laughs> area. I, that is proof. That is proof. <laughs> I don't have to lie. <laughs> it's it's a metal thing. I I. I <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was going to remember to put it on, too. <laughs> okay, maybe I'll put it on when we take a break. <laughs> All right, so this is Seasons 2. She she did a Seasons with 1. This is Seasons 2. And what she did is this little white box is actually a, a canvas box. And she has the instructions right. on where you can get it at. But you can also probably, once you stitched one, you could probably find the little square canvases at like Michael's or Joanne's or something like that. So that would be pretty cool. Ooh. This one is a nice big book. There's a lot of little things in there to finish. This is in a uh, collaboration piece. I'm gonna show you the back because you can see the collaboration between hands-on, oh, it was on the front too. <laughs> hands-on design and Summer House Stitchworks did a collaboration. They worked together as friends to make this uh, between friends uh, book. Oh, that's gorgeous. So, so you get the, you you get the pattern for the main chart, and then you got the little needle book, a little pillow, a little pocket, uh, a little uh, three little biscornias that can stack on top of each other, and uh, I think that was all that was in that. I thought there was like a little scissor fob too. I thought there was a little scissor fob, so there it was on the cover. But um, that's a cute little little series right there. That was. Hands of design. Yep. Now we're going with Threadwork Primitives. There's a we have a series of these. Um we used a little metal used a little metal. I love this it. one. So I really love it. So they've got one for uh win uh Christmas, winter, um Valentine's Day, St. Patrick's Day, and now we've got it one for, for patriotic. I went to that one. And they're very small. They're only about 31 stitches by 77 stitches high. So you're talking about maybe two inches by five inches total design size. So you it's a nice it little look, quick look easy too. Yeah, it'd be a great little piece to to finish yourself and do as an exchange at a, at a retreat or something. No, I don't have time. You don't have time. But you can always start it now for next year. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So that's maybe, threadwork. Maybe. That's threadwork primitives. Great series. I love this series. I love. I really love that one. It's I so need to. Cool. I need to have threadwork primitives as my designer focus for next year because I want to stitch all the little key pieces. 
Now we're going with Sweet Wind Studio. Okay. This one is a is a is a restock because it's one of my favorites, mm -hmm. and we have to we keep buying it because people it, apparently it's everybody else's favorite too, but it's. It's her patriotic series that she's doing. I'm waiting for the next one. This is Franklin's Freedom. So it's all the things about Benjamin Franklin. And she's got a story in there about uh, things um, things that he thought was unnecessary. Those So those are letters in the alphabet that he thought was unnecessary. These are different things. So it's kind of, it's, it's a really cute history piece. And it's a fun little sweet piece that's not that big if you want to display it for the holiday. And then her next one is related to Abraham Lincoln. So it's a stand firm. It's a tribute to Abraham Lincoln. So these are the only two that she has out right now. I'm looking forward to the next one. So that's that's really cute. And these are Stitch with Gentle Arts, Weeks Dye Works, DMC. And then this, so this, there's, um, she's doing a series now. She did the little spring. So now this is a little summer, but it's like, look at all those cute little things you could just Perfect little piece. This is a great piece for a small too. It'd be it's only going to be like five and a half by three, three and a half. So it's a great little smalls piece. I'm now now my brain is all going to smalls. What can you stitch the smalls for? <laughs> and That's cutie. This is a very patriotic. Free birds. Yeah, free birds. All the little flags. All right. And this one is cute too. I don't forget her name. Sweet Wing Studio. No, uh, they, 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 they. Oh, okay. So this one right here is um, God is good, and it's like a like a quilt piece. Isn't that cute? So it's a great little like a little trivet. Yeah, like if you. Yeah, I like that. And back to the shop. Okay, more stuff back to the shop. Yes. Uh, Ron, my favorite. <laughs> Ronnie's favorite um, Piece. pieces are back that he finished. This is a family of. Birds, yes, and then we've got mouth of the flower, mouth of the flower. Okay, so we have these two pieces. I was planning to bring one that was to the retreat, to the retreat, but they arrived late. Yeah, we didn't get the charts till after and we I got back. I want to bring my, I want to bring my um, FFOS, but no one need all ten feet in the car. No, the car was full. So yeah. we'll show some fabric. I believe would probably work with this. These two charts. When we start showing fabric later on, I oh, think yeah. there's a couple of yes. colors that might work pretty good. These are yeah. these are all restocks because it's always mirabilia season in in our world. Um, and this is uh, Lady Justice. You know, patriotic season is around the corner every month. And then we have the there's Snow Queen. Snow Queen. Oh my nemesis! I will work on her one day. <laughs> Uh, she is she is very pretty. She's so big. You need at least a fat half to do her, but she is gorgeous. I've seen her stitched, and that's the only reason she's still in my whip stash. Is that oh, she's so gorgeous. You I love her. And this is an older one. This is Shakespeare's uh, fairies. And I'm thinking of stitching this one on Warlock's Night, the, the the fabric that we have with the moon, the green fabric with the moon. So I think they'll look really cool going through the clouds and stuff, as fairies do. And this is Blossom. She's She was released last year, and so she's she's still popular. Uh, we've got a couple people going to stitch her. This and, one, you and Caroline are doing this. Yeah, this one is the, shall we stitch it together, but not yet, not yet, not yet. Um, we were supposed to start it at StitchCon together one time, and then she had to back out for work. And then we took it to, we both, we did start it to, um, separately, you know, at home. And then she was, we, we said, let's take it with us and stitch it at Stitching in the Wild. And every day is like, oh, let's do it the next day, next day. We ran out of days. <laughs> so we will, we are continuing to stitch World Holiday. I, I'm just hooked on my Halloween and Hawkwind Hollow. I just did not want to put that down. So it's probably more my fault than hers. And Miss Cherry Blossom, isn't she gorgeous? That's on my list to do. And there will the two go finish it, but no. No, who knows? Uh, this is I mean in the retreat. Oh, this yeah. is Cathedral Woods. <coughs> Cathedral <coughs> Woods Goddess, isn't she gorgeous? She's a she's a narrow piece, but I love the colors. Oh, this one is, yeah, 
Oh, I just showed this one a few weeks, uh, a few videos ago. We must have got our back order in too. So we got our order and our back order. So we have plenty of this one now. <laughs> she is so pretty. I definitely, I got to find fabric to stitch her. When I see this one, I'm going to come back and say, oh, I want to do it. And Gary say, it's full coverage. And I say, no, I ain't not doing it. <laughs> Even yeah. I love it. This is a very old one. This is Santa. But it is a full coverage with, um, there's a couple of little bit of beads in there. But I will, oh, God, I love him. He's like my perfect Santa. I, I flush through it and see. Someone did this one? Christmas, all Santas. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh. She had a collection of Santas. Mm. Oh, this I one is Sleeping Princess. See what I mean? We would have had sensory overload. <laughs> and this. And this is Gypsy Mermaid. Oh, look at that. Yeah, we have a girl, in, we have a lady in, in our Zoom who finished her. I know she posted it in the group. Mm -hmm. Very pretty. I will be stitching her one day, but I have to finish two of my mirrors. I, I put a rule on. I have to finish two of my mirrors before I can start start another one. We'll see. I probably started. I probably won't follow that rule. I'm not good with rules. This is Miss Christmas Eve. I've got like five fabrics holding for I bet this for one her. is gorgeous. Done. The picture, I don't think, so giving the credit on yeah. that one. I'm thinking that would be a beautiful piece. I saw this one on the bra on, on a brag table. Really? In stitch con, I think, last time we went. It is very pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the it's, picture that it so helping. Yeah, it's Garden Prelude. All right. And now, these are brand new to the shop. These are Nora's new, Nora's new releases. She releases on the 15th of every month, a Nora or a Mira. So this is this month is uh, is Nora, so we get three. This is the Sunrise Greenhouse. I love this series. I don't know if you guys can figure out why would I love the series. She's doing all these little houses, and they're all green. All green. It's more green for you. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. wow! I think I like that one, but there's they're they're tied. Mm -hmm. They're tied. This is called Paper Magnolia. Let me get the glare off. There we go. Look at that. Isn't she pretty? So she, there, that's part of her, um, let's see, what, what is it a series? Uh, I'm not sure what series it's called. I don't see it on here. But I saw somewhere that it was listed as a series. Here's the other one. This one has a little bit more beads on her. She is, um, mm. I'll put the name on the back, uh, Ruffle Fern. Look at that. That is really cute. So now we're going to our dear Erica Michaels. Yep, Erica Michaels did a trunk show at our. You have to push in that one that yeah. way. And this is okay. Coming back. All right. Um, this one was actually released when when it was exclusive. It was called Coco Chanel, Coco something, and now it's called the Embroideress. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We have one finishing kit. Where that we still have one finishing yes. kit. Yes. Those are finishing kits made by Lady Dot. And this is Mary Briggs. Really? Mary Briggs. This is Eric Michael's done the sampler. And then Sally Bullard. Yep. We have this we have the wool thread pack from Jumbo Arts to do that. So so we have a thread pack. A very Alpha berries. Okay. Oh, no, this one's mine. I like this one. <laughs> okay. This right here is so cool. It's the alphabet stitched at an at an angle, and you finished it in a different way. And then this one's coming out at an angle, and then so it's three uh, berries with alphabets on them. Chinese these were brand new releases. Hard. Yeah, these th these three were just brand new releases before we we left for stitching the wild, and I brought them with us. So everyone could have the experience of getting them first. This is a sampler. For all the seasons. Yeah. This is spring and summer. We're waiting for autumn and winter. And it's, you just need one color. It's one color each. Uh, I think you need at least two skeins of each of, of the color to do them on 37 count. Ooh, the, the green, um, the, um, 
Cottage Gardens Rights would be great. As well as <laughs> yeah, yeah, the ones that we had in the club mm -hmm. last year. Yeah, or this year. That would be gorgeous. Mm -hmm. You got a lot of pretty colors yeah. to pick from. Yes, I'm thinking that could be one. And now we've got uh, the mini sampler, mini sampler book. And so, oh, here's here's a better view of it. So you got all those little panels you you stitch, and then um, it's not focusing. It's looking at our faces. <laughs> Is it focusing? It's good. Oh, never had that problem before. Okay. And now we got Boardwalk Review. Maybe the light? I don't know. Okay, so this is Boardwalk Review. It's oh, it's a berry. And this little piece, it was made into like a needle. Like a, uh, what's it made into? I'm not sure. It's like a, a pocket. It's called a pocket. But you could frame that or, or put it. It would look cute if it was finished in that little tray. That would be cool. And this the is Shepherd's Care 2. Shepherd's Care 2. There's a 1 also, but this is 2. So you got a little drum, a little squatty drum, a little berry, and a little needle book. So those are cute. And, and this yeah, one. One <laughs> your favorite. This is one of my favorites. I still have to finish this. You know, I haven't finished. I did the berry, but I haven't done the other pieces. Because I just love this piece so much. I just don't want to. I don't want to stop working on it because... I like to pick it up and work on it a little bit and put it back down and visit it again. So this is All Hallows Eve. This was our exclusive design in our um, first Halloween box, mm -hmm. first box we ever did. And it was it was really a, still one of my dear, near and dear favorites. I think they all are, but I love them all. This is um, Forever Thine, and you get the little envelope, little envelope button, and then there's a little heart button that goes on top of the berry. Little heart metal piece that goes on top of the berry. So they're all in there too. Yeah. So that's kind of A cute. little heart and a little, little button. Yeah, a little button. Yeah. So uh, I had these colors pulled out. This is a very, the colors are so pretty for this piece. I'm sorry, but the shirt's no adding water. This is Shepherd's Care 1. We already passed two. Yeah. So this one has three samplers excerpts from it so i i would say uh two is probably more excerpts so as a collection that would be really pretty together this one was fun this one this is called um let's, are we keeping you away? i don't know all right this goes with this one that goes with that so this is three wise women oh, okay yeah this is uh three wise women brought nappies formula and casserole they stayed for babysitting tea and laundry that's cool. So when I was reading this, I'm thinking, I wonder what three wise stitchers would bring. Just thought it would be kind of so cool. This is cute. The sewing bee. Mm -hmm. And this one coming with the little scissors. You can see it. Oh, yeah. The little scissors. Where you put those? Oh, and it goes. The buttons. Yeah, the little scissors go right. You can put them right there. And the little buttons go on, on the berry. Oh, no, they go. The little heart button right here, and then a, a little ruffle button mm -hmm. goes right there. This way. That way you can oh, ap yeah. appreciate it more. Uh, there. There you go. Yeah. So that's cool. Try to not put it out of the, the bag because I'm not afraid to lose it. Yep. And this is turkey time. Oh, yeah. This one. <laughs> All right, I see now why I have a lot of whips because this is in my but stash to whip yeah. to stitch. That turkey is so cool. The colors, look at that. There's like a purple. It's not normal turkey colors. It's like a blue, a green, a purple. It's very fall. Was I shaking too much? No, it was me. Oh. <laughs> All right. You guys see, it's going to be fun to put all this stuff back together. All right. This is a five-part series. It's called Quilting ABCs. That one is yeah. This is part one. Uh, we are doing auto ship with this, this series. So uh, if you want to sign up, send us an email. And then when we get it in, that way we'll know how many to order in. So we order enough in. And then we'll send you an invoice for the parts as they come in. But this is um, part one. 
A, B, C, and then part two is already out. So it's you're still not too late to start the series. But um, so that'll be, this is a really nice, it's a nice big piece. And then also you could do like uh, pull outs. You could pull out your favorite squares and make like the little gift pillow. So this is the pillow that's in this design. And then the next design had another little pillow part that you would do. So and can make another pallet, please. Yeah. I want to go and tap the that. Okay. This one has this. Okay. And this, this is stitch all the things. Oh, I did this. Ronnie did the little pillow for me. I stitched that and he did that. I still got to do the berry. Stitch all the things. You know, you, you when you see these pictures, they, they are very intimidating to me. But when I was seeing the models and the berries there, I'm like, that could be doable. I mean, they're, they're, they're very doable looks. You just have to get over yourself and just start cutting the ruffles and put it on there. This is English sampler berries. Oops, this way. Aren't those cute? I love, the, see the lions? And there's a squirrel. There's always an evil squirrel somewhere in there. And then, was, that's, what do they call it? Those, that rose, um, Tudor rose. It looks like a Tudor rose is what it was called. And this is, oh, this was another one that I pulled the threads for. And we had kits, we have some thread kits for. It's the heirloom tomato. Buttons. Yeah, is there a little heart button? No, there's no heart button in this kit. Okay, and oh, it's a ruffle. The little little ruffle button right there. Yeah. But this, these colors are so cute. I wanna try the look. Very nice and bright. And this Walker, was good with some berries. Yeah, this these were berries from a club piece, and she released it to the rest of us. It's uh, live simply, uh, give more, and expect. I think it says expect less. I think that's mm, what it was saying. Right. So, so these are uh, wis wisdom Quaker wisdom berries. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so this one right here is another one in the crossword series. So I just have to finish. I have to finish my Halloween one. I've done the Liberty one, and I've done the Christmas one. So now, when, and I want to do the beach one because I have some chocolate milk, and that's the called for fabric is uh, chocolate milk fabrics by Stephanie. So it's a little berry, little drum, and the lighthouses there. That's that's a sweet piece. Uh oh, okay. I, I see the box is getting close. That is box one. Yep, that was Erica Michaels. Okay, now, now we're going with Stitchy Pros. Okay, and I need to get some green drink. Uh, when pigs fly. Oh, sorry, it's just yeah, when pigs fly. And there's a needle minder, so we can show the needle minder at the same time. Uh, okay, I don't know. It's that one, the pig. <laughs> Uh, what well, what is the pig? Oh, wasn't that? Yeah, she make a needle mind this for most of for, for this pattern. Yeah, so it's when pigs fly. So that's a cute little piece, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that's not gonna happen for me. This is the tea time. Let me set this one over here. This is from the um, the tea time palette that uses the twin way silks. Trin Ray, Trin Ray Silks that came out at, at Nashville. So this is Tea Time, Stitchy Pros. Um, and she has a wooden board that you would finish this on. Look, like it looks like a little teapot. I'll pop a picture and it's easier to, to do it that way. This is Summer Pum. Okay, this one. The next two are, the these were, two. she brought them to the retreat and we were the first shop to buy them. So other shops will not get these two charts for another two weeks. So we have a little exclusive window on Summer Puns and Red Sky. Yeah. So Summer Puns is Tropic Like It's Hot and Seize the Day are the puns. And then this one right here says Red Sky at Night, Sailor's Delight. Red Sky in at Morning, Sailors Take Warning. So... So that's how it's finished here on this on the cover. I'll pop in the picture of 
of how she finished it, finished the model for the retreat. I know someone who love lighthouses. Mm -hmm. This is perfect for yeah. people who love lighthouses. Sorry. You mean like Pam? <laughs> Pam. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Other yes. person. Oh. All right. So this is for our bee people. This is the Honey Craft Crafts Men Sampler. Sorry, Shireen, you just did this video. Look at that. I mean, you just need simple fabric for this. You don't need anything special. You know, just like a light, um, you know, light fabric. And and look at, you stitch all the, um, the little honeycombs and everything. You fill some in. Mm -hmm. That is cute. This one is with this one? Uh, we sh no, this is with this one. Oh yeah, I'm giving you two. Mm -hmm. Holly, Holly, Holly has a whole series. Stitcher Bros has a whole series on puns. So she's going to be doing more puns. She's got lots of puns in her head. Um, I love puns. There's and so these are the Halloween puns. This is, uh, let's see, where is uh, let's let's get lit. <laughs> That's fun. And then the next one is right save here. your buddy. Your booty. <laughs> and there's a little, look, there's a little, okay, I know some of the millennials won't know it, but that is a tape recorder boom box. <laughs> That's so cool. Okay. All right. So this is, uh, this is a forever timeless morning sampler. So this is a, it's a sweet one. I mean. It's very pretty. It's very elegant how it's done. So it's a nice. It's gorgeous. Yeah. Now we have another one that has a needle minder. It's probably the frog. What do you think? I'm thinking it is. Yeah, it's a stitcher's wish. Starlight, star bright. First star I see tonight. I wish I may. I wish I might. Cross all my X's right so I don't have to frog tonight. I think we all should do this one. <laughs> It's cute. Yeah. Okay. Um, pattern. Okay. All right. And this is this is um, Holly's number one pattern. Her first pattern she made, and when she created her company, Stitchy Pros. Yeah. So we saw this. I saw this. Um, we we. Oh, that's right. It was we. Yeah. Two three years ago. Yeah, three years ago. Twenty twenty one is when it was released. This yeah. is a summertime sunshine sampler. Uh, Holly loves um, sunflowers. So they're very, very pretty. Look at all those sunflowers. So cute. Yes. And these are some Biscoin news. This is a Christmas one with cats. Merry Meowmas Biscoin you. So these are kind of small. It's uh, 60 by 60. And then there's a Halloween one. Instead of saying monster, it says Mouster Mash Biscognu. You have to really be careful when you say these things. She makes you uh, slow down and read. <laughs> Look at that. Is it cute? <clears throat> All right. Yes. And now we're in. Now we're up to Thanksgiving. We're all over the place. We definitely don't put things in order. This is uh, <laughs> this is gobble. That was me. This is gobble, gobble till you wobble. So that would probably be most Sunday nights after you eat. Is that a little gnome? It's a gnome with a turkey on his hat. Gnomes are everywhere. And Holly does put in a little bit of uh, specialty stitches here and there. She'll put a Smyrna cross in there. So you can either do the Smyrna crosses or you can do regular X's. I mean, she gives you the instructions on how to do them. So it's it's really up to you how you want to do it. Yeah, that was the stitchy press for now, mm -hmm. and, and we jump to Jan Hicks creates. This one is very hot. This is oh oh wait we forgot to show. So I think the tea sippers. This is tea sippers needle minder. I think that would go with one of any of the, her bee patterns that she has from Stitchy Pros. Yes. And then this would this is her new needle minder that she had at the retreat. It's called No Crabby Attitudes. And we had none. So this is a good luck piece for me. So we will be taking this to every retreat we go or have. No crabby atti attitudes. Yep. 
All right, now back to Jan Hicks. <laughs> this is, uh, what, the third or fourth time I've ordered these charts in. I took a couple of these to the retreat with us, and they sold out. So this is E. Pluminus Unum. It's a, it's a very patriotic flag with interesting, I'm going to say they're interesting colors because there's like some pinks and roses and burgundies in there that you don't associate with the flag. But when you do those stitches, it's, this piece is, has appealed to a lot of people, even the ones who don't do um, patriotic stitching because it's so intriguing. It is a very cool piece. And like we say, we know how to murder and forget showing you guys the bead pack Here's, on the Noracrobet designs. Yeah, um, this is for the sunrise greenhouse that we showed. So we got the bead pack. That's really the good and thing the about the Norris. Ruffler firm. Yeah, Ruffler firm. That is so you can see how many beads for... there are in the pattern. Yes. Wow. And, yeah. and then a few uh, months ago, we got a bunch of metal um, bell pulls that are easy to slide in and slide off. So you can always change your belt. Like if you have a, a welcome piece, you can always change your hardware to go with your seasons. So this is um, this is a Christmas one. This is balsam split. Look at that. This is under when you it's it's under our website under uh, bell poles. So if you just type in bell pull two words, it'll come up with a bunch of them that we have. So this is a metal one, and this is six inches. And then look at this. Well, look at, Halloween is perfect. Of course. I mean, what else could it could be for Easter? I don't know, but. I think Halloween. So move your fingers so they can see the split. So that's how you would you would hem your, your bell pull and then you would just slide it in and slide it off. So it's easy for the stitcher to do. Mm -hmm. don't, don't look at me, I'm not doing it. I'll give it to you. All right. All right. Wow. Yeah. Now we're going for fabrics. Okay. Because the, we have fabric by Stephanie in the house and stitching in the wall. Right, so I was very good. And I was very good at the retreat. I let everybody buy the fabric that Stephanie had. And on Sunday, I said, I want it. I'll take the rest of it. So otherwise, I was going to take it all before. Because <laughs> you know I love fabric. This is a 14 count falling leaves. And it's a fat quarter. Most of these, we have one piece. And this is what I'm yeah, calling it. One piece or maybe two, but mostly one piece. So if you see it. Um, I wouldn't think too long. We can always reorder, but um, these are the colors. Imagine we have this beautiful blue. This is a 14 count midnight trist. I love it. Yeah. And that's also a fat quarter. Coming shiny. Uh, now these are opals. Coming shiny. No, it's called opal. This is a, uh, a 13 by 18. So it's a smaller piece. It's friendship green oh, with opal. Uh, there, there you go. Right there. There you go. You guys can see some of the sparkle. Yeah. So, so this yeah. is a smaller piece. It's not a fat quarter. It's what they call a fat eighth, a 13 by 18. And now we have another opal that's 13 by 18. I'm sorry. And it's, it's perfect for Halloween. Not because I like Halloween, but I love Halloween. But it's called Twix and Tween. Mm, you can yeah. see it right there. Yeah. I mean, and this is another uh, 13 by 18. It's perfect for, I just can't imagine. It's a 14 count. Jeez. And this is another 14 count. This is called Ice Crystals. So this is perfect for like a Christmas piece because it's wow. got a little bit of sparkle on it. Oh, it's beautiful. And again, it's a 13 by 18. And it's, uh, that right there. Yeah, there it is. You can see oh, yeah. the sparkles. Okay. So is that the last of the 14 count? Uh, yes. Okay. Now we're going to go to 18 count. 18 count. And, and this is a, an opal and it's Harvest Pumpkin. For, there, there you go. Right there. Yeah. There you go. There you can see some of the sparkle and some of the modeling. Look at the modeling. It's really cool modeling. Perfect. Yes, I mean, you could do like, um, I'm just thinking there's some 
Halloween, great Halloween pieces on the like all black pieces that would be perfect on something like that. And that was all there. That's all the opals. And now we have an 18 count. This is a fat quarter. And this is simply sage. I hear it's someone's unicorn fabric, but I'm working on it. Simply sage. Mm. It's it's close for me, it's close to friendship green. It's just a little different, a little bit lighter or darker. I can't remember offhand now. And now we have, uh, oh, speaking of, the name of this fabric is called Gina. And G-I-N-A. And it's, this is a 40 count and it's a fat quarter. Now, um, let me, I want to hold this all the way up because so you can see, see where this one um, slight splotch is. You could you could move this around and get it where you want it. So you, you can make that a feature or you well, can wait, wait. slowly hide it. <coughs> this is sun. Yeah. And like then, a horse. Yeah. So I always look at every side. See, this one's a little less modeled on that side. So always play with your fabric. Mm -hmm. And I, I say that, but I ended up wait I end up wasting mm -hmm. a lot of fabric because I, I stitch in the middle or I stitch in this corner or that corner. So I look for the piece that I want to highlight that the dyer's done on the fabric. All right. I got stacks everywhere. This one is? Uh, this is a 28 count summer breeze. Look at that. That's that's a perfect, I, I could see it like a Santa on here or something. This is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Or mermaid, merman. Uh, this is, sorry. this is a 40 count. Okay, so let's, 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 I gotta, sorry, my OCD's kicking in. I gotta put the 40 in with 40. This is Snow Drifts by Fabrics with Stephanie, and it's a flat quarter, 40 count. All right. I'm hoping these colors are showing through because it's really right. pretty. This is another 40 count. This is Change Lane. This is, this would be perfect for, or like uh, Joan Elliott, All Hallows Eve, I think. I don't know, maybe like a solid, all of black stitching and stuff in there. It looks really cool. It's gorgeous. Yeah. All right. We have a lot of fabric to show, guys. Yeah. <coughs> all right, so now we're doing 36 count. And this is apple blossom. I don't put it in order. I just I had it, it I box. had it in order when I gave it to him. This is apple blossom. It's a 36 count. Um this yeah, it's very pretty. This is 36 count 13. Yep. Yeah, so this is a 36 count autumn splendor and it's a smaller cut. It's a 13 by 18. Look at that. Burg is it like burgundy or yes. maroon? More like maroon, I think. Oh. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I'm trying to figure out how it was folded. <laughs> da, 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 da. All right, so that's it from those. Is I moving things out of my way? All right, now we have 32 count. And we have a lot of 32 count. This is Abyss. And I do know we have two pieces of, of Abyss. And this is a fat quarter. Look at that. That's close to, I mean, if that's close, if you like black, this is as close to black as I get. It's, it would be, oh, this would be actually good for Sleepy Hollow by Glendon Place. It's a very nice dark blue. Now we have, we've got four pieces of the Harvest Pumpkin. Look at that. I mean, you know, I can't refuse a good orange. Just as yeah. good as a good green. Yes. This is more of a, um, not really a bright, bright orange, just more of a a grungy orange. That's like kind of slightly, you know, darker. I'm trying to not mix the, the names. Yeah. And this is called Grace. Well, the colors. Look at that. Wow. That is very fall. You could do a scarecrow on that. Gorgeous. Yeah. Ooh, or maybe even, I don't know. I'm trying to look, I'm looking at my wall. Maybe even a witch could look cool on that. Mm -hmm. 
the, the brain is going. Uh, this is Jack's Rum, another 32 count, fat quarter. Again, a lot of these are just onesies because um, we, we bought everything she had at the retreat. We lightened her load for the going home. This is a very mustard. Yeah, that's a, that's a good reference in, reference yeah, point. For very it. mustard. Yeah, I love it. I love mustard and, and everything. <laughs> he must be hungry. We will go out to eat after the video. I'm hungry. <laughs> All right, uh, over here. Oh, 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 wait, wait. Sorry. All right, this is my favorite color from Stephanie's. It's called Kaleidoscope. Between Kaleidoscope and Banshee, it's like they're neck and neck. This is Kaleidoscope. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you could you could stitch a mermaid on that, merman, uh, any other pretty lady, um, an all black piece, uh, skeleton, very Halloween. It's it's very um, eclectic piece. This is two of my favorite colors because I love the brightness, the bright, bright, Bright. Brightness. This is apple blossom. Brightness. Yeah, we had it in yeah. 36 and we have it in 32. It's yeah. looking a little blue. It's actually uh, pink does that. Sorry. Pink. No, it's it's pink. It, yeah. It doesn't wasn't want to re uh, maybe there. No. No, now it's worse. There is mostly in this area is it's for some shadow. I don't know what is yeah. go, gone in the video. Yeah. But yeah, is this this corner here is a real color. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's apple blossom and 32 count. It's hard to cut the real um, color. You know what would look good on that? I'm, I'm sorry. I'm the um, this cherry blossom. Look at that. Oh, I got to see it. I, get, I can't get it out of my head. That cherry blossom. There you go. Look at that. She'll look good on that. Because this gives it modeling. They did it on a plain pink that just went blah. Right. Okay. Picks it down. Mm -hmm. Do, 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 do. Oh, this one. Love this one. It's my favorite name. Hocus Pocus. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Oh, that good. would also, look, this would also look good with Sleepy Hollow from Glendon Place. Mm -hmm. I think. Give it a different look, different feel. All right. But wait, there's more. <laughs> oh. Uh-oh. Sorry. Oh, we have more of oh, uh, Yeah, in, in 32. This is uh, Valerian Steel. I mean, I think you guys know from Game of Thrones. So we have three pieces of this one. Look, it's, this is... Got some purple and green and gray undertones to it. Pull it back. Is it coming through? Yeah, I can see it okay. from here. Yeah. Yeah, I can see it from here. Okay. Yeah, a witch would look really cool. One of the Nor Corbett witches would look great on that. Ooh, wow. I got so many ideas. Now, this is, uh, now we're into opals. This is um, 32 count dried thistle. Miss Christmas Eve would be perfect on that, wouldn't she? Ooh. Let's see, pink ash, the uh -oh. sparkles. Uh oh, look at that. Uh oh, wow. That would work with her. Perfect. Yeah, 32 count. Yeah. And we have two pieces of that, so. All right, and then we have, um, this is called um, Vintage Tiffany. This was the fabric that Stephanie dyed for Kathy Haberman's Secret Santa series. But this is an opal. I didn't know they had the opal. Because oh. that it makes it really cool with the opal. Oh, yeah, there you go. So, I want this one. <laughs> yeah, so you can do the Santas with the opal. Oh, man. But I, I'm halfway finished with my Santas. That's mm. gorgeous. I like bright colors. Mm -hmm. I'm going crazy for bright okay, colors. Okay, now we're going to skip to Ada. This is this is Wichelt. This is a uh, country country French cafe mocha sixteen count. We've got a couple of pieces of this. This is yeah. This is used in the Nor Corbett um, Zodiac series. Yeah, I'm fighting with this one for take the picture. Mm -hmm. um, and the picture is still not doing good. Yeah, but... I used the photo from I used the photo from Wichelt. It's a little circle. Yeah, 
Oh, um, okay. I'm thinking that one. Yeah, because... What do you think about? Okay, what do you guys think of family of family of birds on that fabric? Mm. What do you think? I would be more neutral. I mean, it's more neutral versus the purple or pink. Yes. Yeah, I think it would be. I think it'd be cute. Yeah. Yeah. Go be a, like a uh, like more a flesh. Hispanic. Yeah. Yeah. Be yeah. A nice flesh tone. Uh, Okay, so I'll put this over Maybe here. Anastasia again. No. Why not? You can do it. You can do yeah. it. Now we're back to Stephanie. Yeah. This is 36 count chocolate milk. And we've got a couple of pieces. We got like, we got a couple of pieces. I love chocolate milk. Cool. So that's what you would do with the Beaches Calling. So you could do it on 36 count and it would be perfect. Keep it nice and small, easy to see. Mm. I need to get me a piece of chocolate milk. All right, this is another 36 count. This is Gina. Again, this is Gina in a 36 count. So, you hold it in my face. Mm -hmm. What am I holding? Oh, I'm going to show it to you. I'm far away here. All right. So this has got some some of the blues and greens, purplish, purplish blues. Look at that. As a 36 count, I think you could still do a mermaid on this. You might have to adjust your beads um, to to make them fit. But yeah. And now the camera's gonna go crazy because it looks like a murder scene about to happen. Pop it up. Let's see if it go crazy. <gasps> Look at that. This Ooh. is gorgeous. Uh, I would tell you what the name of it is, but I'm busy. This, this is Versailles. 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 That's it. All right, there goes my reading for today. There's your assignment to read that. Versailles. Yeah. Versailles. Okay, and this is a 32 count. And we only have a few pieces of this one. It's perfect for Christmas piece. There we have. Driftwood. Driftwood. All right. And this is a 32 count. Mm -hmm. I like greenish. Yeah, it's more autumny fall colors. Yeah. A little like a redwood, a um, little bit of green over here. I love the veining. You see the, there we go. You can see the veining. That's in the fabric. That's not folds. There's no wrinkles. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah. All right, so that's that one. Is it the last fabric? Nope, I have. Two. But wait, there's more. <laughs> I have two more. Okay, uh, this one is Cascade, and it's 32 count. We've got a couple of pieces of this one. This one's gorgeous. It looks like this one looks like the ocean. It looks like water. Yes. Doesn't it look like water in the ocean. Perfect for a beachy piece. Do we have a beachy piece over here? Hmm. Yeah, we do. On, um, oh, I'm thinking of somebody's uh, beachy piece exclusive for the retreat. I don't know if the colors would work. Mm -hmm. All right, put that there. And the last fabric from Stephanie. My favorite fabric is Jamie's kilt from Outlander. <laughs> <laughs> and this is. It's very close to me. It's very close to Kaleidoscope, but it's very washed down. So you can see all the colors. You see all the colors are all over here. So this is a 32 count fat quarter. And my shoulders hurt. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is only video part one. One. <laughs> yep. That all right. is all what we have back in the store. Yep. That's all. And new things. All right, so at this point, we want to do our major, major thank yous for, we're going to say this many times. We want to thank, thank, thank everyone who came to the retreat. Yes. Uh, without you guys, it would not have been a good retreat. What you put out comes back in. You guys put out good vibes. We, we received good vibes. We gave good vibes. So it's the spirit of the event that makes you want to come back. And yes. so that being yes, said, for you guys, yeah, the routine not gonna be no no as beautiful as I was. Yeah. yeah. So and we, we want we want to thank uh, Stephanie from Fabrics by Stephanie for bringing 
for being a vendor at our retreat. She was sold her fabrics there. You guys were able to order from her and buy from her. And it was really fun to get that interaction with you. I know a couple of you sat there and discussed fabric choices and, and pattern choices. That was really fun. See that interaction going on. And then um, we want to thank Fox and Rabbit for yes. the uh, freebie, freebie design. They, they designed for our goodie bag. Yeah. Um, that was really cool. We actually had a lot of people start it at the retreat, which is fun because that's why we had the thread packet. Mm -hmm. And then we want to thank Holly from Stitchy Pros. She provided two uh, mini little freebies that we had kitted up with the floss pack. That we were showing. We'll show it in part two. In, yes. That's why I, wa I wanted to get the thank yous here yes. so I don't forget because I'm so excited. Um, and then we want to thank Rami's Creations because Rami created the amazing little monsters for us. And one of the ladies stitched the monster at the start of the retreat for the Smalls Exchange. She was... It was so cool. I'll pop a picture in. I think it's it's one of my favorite little yes. little finishes. Um, and then we want to thank Teresa Kogut so much for providing an exclusive design for Stitching in the Wild. Uh, I love her dedication that she put on there. And there was quite a bit of people that was so excited about that pattern. They started it as well. I think basically all of our charts that was for the retreat Somebody, there was someone, at least a few people, starting every one of the... Every chart was just started. Yeah. And here and there, but yes, they yeah. started. Yeah. And then uh, we want to thank uh, Tracy from Ink Circles. She also did an exclusive design for us. Yes. And um, it's very cool beachy design. And everyone, there's quite a bit of people who started that one. Uh, Southeast Stitchers, she do yes. us a special design. Yep, she she and took our logo and converted it to cross stitch, and we'll show you what we did with it at the retreat in the next part. Yes, <laughs> and and then we want to thank uh, Linda from Erica Michaels for uh, uh, providing the amazing trunk show with her models, and and uh, we had the patterns for her models. And then we also want to thank Kathy from Hands on Design for providing her models and the trunk show as well. So with that thank correlation, you so thank you guys much. so, yes. so much. And we appreciated your kindness and uh, our attendees. I'm thinking they mm -hmm. loved all your uh, freebies, all your um, trunk shows. Yes. Um, you say a stitchy press to make yep. a show trunk. Trunk show. Trunk yes. show. Yes, yes. I've <laughs> See what yeah. I mean? That's why I said. So yeah. I did the freebie trunk show. Yes. Yeah. And she was a participant and, in the retreat. Oh, I don't have the heart. I don't know when I'm putting the heart. And show it in the next part. What heart? Uh, the heart uh, Romy Creations oh, make yes. us read right. the thread that yeah. she Yes, Romy also for us. created a exclusive thread for Garan called Garan Colors. Yes. And uh, we will be carrying that. We'll keep that in stock. Mm -hmm. And we'll keep carrying that floss. Yeah, but she make she cross stitch a little hard for us, and yeah. she sent it to us. Mm -hmm. Yes. So, uh, that being said, we're going to pause, a little pause, and clean up, we'll be right back, and then put more stuff out. So, thank you guys. We are, are back. back. We had our grand opening ceremony of our LNS at the Sheridan in Fort Lauderdale. Yes. Uh, it's a mobile LNS, so it's an MLS. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So uh, we had a ribbon cutting ceremony, and we'll, we'll pop a little video later on yes. in there, the ribbon cutting ceremony. I, I, I had a couple of, of mini videos, and we had tons of uh, pictures. Mm -hmm. Yeah. We, so we, we will go... edit them down and, and get... Um, some of the less uh, duplicated pictures and yes. put them in there. We start. We're gonna start with the goodie bag. We start the retreat. Oh, the day before almost. You know what? You know what? Can we go back a little bit? Yeah. Can we go back to like maybe twelve months? Twelve months. Yeah. Holy the cow! Cost, <laughs> I, 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 you know, I'm sitting there and I'm realizing, last night while I was stitching, twelve months ago, like on the eleventh of of May. We signed the contract for the hotel room. Yes. And nobody knew we were going to do the retreat. And then we put out that we we're going to do the retreat. And then we sold it, you know, sold the spots in September. And then we hurry up and waiting. But from May, 
this until this May, we were like coordinating with designers. Every time we'd go on to like um, talk to a designer, we say, okay, what can we do this and do that? And what kind of space? We're buying baskets for display. It's all these little mini things that we did over time. Yeah. And the whole time at the retreat, at the beginning, first day of the retreat, I was so paranoid because I'm like, I didn't feel like we did enough. Like, so did we do everything right? Because, you know, we didn't have a staff of 20. We didn't have a staff of 15. We had Ronnie and I, and we had Kathy. And we have an and we And we had, we had volunteers. Yes. And then we had, we had Betty. Before, I'm thinking, I'm saying before the retreat. Oh, yeah. They yeah, helped yeah, us yeah, with yeah, all yeah, these yes. little tasks here and there when they could. A little bit here, a little bit there. We're very yes. grateful for for their contribute contributing to the the planning phase and the working phase. Mm -hmm. Yes, and and that helped take some of the pressure off of us, making sure that we had everything. But it, a lot has happened. We had no idea when we signed that that we were going to sell and move to Alabama. What not even if someone would have said that, I said you're lying, <laughs> you know. So it was. A lot of things happening, and and every everything that happened is a blessing. Yes, it is a blessing, and it was to the end goal. And you guys had an amazing weekend because of all our blessings, and we were able to give to you, and and we wanted to share more of that with us, with you. Yes. So, um, shall we start with what did you see at at the um what what did they get first when they came in to sign in? Start hitting the table because you move the camera. I'm Every time excited. you don't move the, the table, and I'm he excited. is. I'm excited. I'm <laughs> excited. Yeah. Well, was unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Unbelievable. The kind and the love wasn't there. Mm -hmm. Every single person was so lovely, so kind, and I'm very thankful for the rest of my life. Mm -hmm. Um, we, the first day we arrived, we meet some girls that we never meet in person ladies. before. <laughs> I say girls. They, until they, I don't know, call you ladies, I call you my girls. <laughs> <laughs> well, ladies, I'm called girls. Um, we had an amazing day. Mm -hmm. And escaped to the casino that night, mm -hmm. and I know lose and win twenty dollar. Okay, it was fun. Yeah, and have fun yeah. there. The next morning, we the hotel staff was amazing, amazing, amazing. Uh, when the retreat start, I go to one of the housekeepers, one lady, and I'm asking to please be sure the ladies' bathroom was clean and was. Um, Stuck, stuck, <laughs> and she run to the bathroom and she, fifteen minutes or so, and she coming to me and she say, and I tell her the angle have around ninety ladies there, and you know mm -hmm. we need to be sure they was good, and she's so kind and she take care take care of immediately, and she coming to me and she say everything is clean, everything is stuck. Yeah. For the ladies. See, that's things Ronnie thinks about stuff like that that are just like, yeah, it's different perspectives. Yeah, yeah. And you know, when they help me, I'm helping them yeah. in some way. Yeah, because they're working hard for mm -hmm. us. Yeah. And um, and there uh, we are. The only disappointment for me in the hotel was the the restaurant because it was very slow. Yeah, but but when but, everybody when you think about it, hotel restaurants are normally are not set up, staffed, or designed to feed everyone that lives that stays in the hotel. Yeah. They're really set up for the business guy who wants to come in for a quick snack and leave. Yeah. We had too many people. But everybody was um yeah. was very good, uh very entertaining. Um what uh Tony. Oh was very Madonna Tony. Yeah he was very entertaining. <laughs> um but I want to talk about that Thursday morning that we were doing the registration? Oh, uh, that was a re no, no, was no, no, no. stress. I, Ronnie was already up in the morning and I was coming down the elevator. Every time we go anywhere, Ronnie's wearing green. The reason Ronnie wears green, so I can find him and I can calm down. If I see him, like when we're at Galleria or we're at Nashville and they've got the open 
floors and I'm on the third floor, I can look around. If I see that lime green shirt on the second floor or the fifth floor, I'm relaxed. I can calm down. Okay, I can focus. When I don't come out of the room, I'm still half asleep, no coffee, get in the elevator, the elevator's glass. I look down, I see a, you know, it was a sea of green shirts. And I had that panic and I was like, okay, <laughs> where's Ronnie? <laughs> I was like, that quick panic. You're like, okay, don't worry. You know these people, <laughs> they're your people. <laughs> so I'm like, okay, then I go down and, and when I come around out of the elevator, there he comes down the hall. I'm like, oh, there's Ronnie, hey, what's up? <laughs> yeah, we are sitting down taking a breakfast and, and uh, there when I see the line, my breakfast not arrived when I see people start making line and I'm panicking. I'm in my eggs fast yeah. and I'm running and I'm open and there, uh, uh, who was it? Agina, Andrea, I'm sorry, I forgot. I was panicking yeah, we had a... and they come in and held this. No, 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 we had to do this different because somehow everything on the table and fit. And then Gina started the bags and started filling the the the, Put the goodies uh, in the bag. Yep, goodies they have the um, how you what is called the, the lanyards, the, the handles for mm -hmm. the tag. And I have anyway. Mm -hmm. So let's show Gina, the Gina, Andrea, and everybody who helped me in that moment. Thank you, thank you, yeah. thank you. This is the bags we are giving. We 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 did for the retreat for the retreat. And there we put her. They had some goodies inside the bag. And little for them. Or trash can. It's an orc can, and we put a little sticker on there that says Stitching the Wild 2023. Yeah. And it's in the uh, approved color. <laughs> yes. It's perfect because I have one, and I always when I finish when I finish a whip, that's when I empty it. Yes. We have the thread, right? The rum is creation who mm -hmm. made for Garon. Yep, and we and we provided the thread in the bag so everyone could get at least one skein. And then we also had it for sale in the event and we have it on the website. We have a pen, the mm -hmm. stitching in the wall that we forgot by um no nope. uh, So uh, everyone was probably writing on their hand. Their <laughs> then we had the keychain or I think it's a, a great we floss use drop. It, we use it in uh I'm thinking a stitch con. One year. One year. And we put a um, DMC. Uh -huh. Gary Green. Yeah, Gary Green DMC. <laughs> you can use it. It could like be even Ronnie, Ronnie Green. And she already the pen. Uh huh. Okay. We have green. Lanyard. Lanyard. Yeah. And there I make. To everybody who attended a mini, ba a mini, mini, what did you call it? I, I I call them an itsy bitsy itsy bitsy mini bag itsy bitsy bag yeah and they were that all, was the original mini bag that yeah, was they're the, all multiple colors random random fabrics that he had so yes. I there might have been I don't think anybody had <laughs> there was two people that had the same bag if there was it was very rare yeah. but so it's a great little bag for for put this little bit of stuff in yeah you know, let's keep it in there. Yeah, that is what was in the and, bag. Yep, yeah. and with the, with and the zipper on the bag, this made a great shopping bag for people to carry their stuff around. You put your garron bag in there; it's great size. Yep, and uh, in there in the envelope we have the freebie charts, mm -hmm. and um, so the so, freebie charts. So let's uh, show the first freebie chart from um, Stitchy Pros. Stitchy Pros, we. Sisha, that is the one where we have the paper in front, the last, mm -hmm. last couple of videos ago. Yeah. And, and this is Velveteen from Lady.Create. She does, she dyed this color for us. So we will be getting that um, later on in the year in the shop for sale. It's an exclusive color yeah. for Garon. Gary stitched this one and I'm finished it. Mm -hmm. I did it on a 36 count uh, fiber on a whim um, plum. I remember. Yes. <laughs> yes. And uh, there and we had the old second stitchy pros. This is hog wild. This was a uh, bee wild pattern. And this is hog wild. Ronnie stitched this one mm -hmm. on a mystery count Ada, a mystery color Ada he, he had in his stash. And it just happened to match the exclusive um, velveteen that Lady Dot created for us for later on this year. Yes. It was kind of, it was kind of like 
Oh, how cute. It matches. And there we do. We created the thread packs for both of these patterns to encourage people to stitch it and start it at the retreat. And it worked. Yeah, because the designers were so kind to make us the, the freebies. And we tried the, the motivate the attendees to love it. Yeah. Like we do. Mm -hmm. And then this is the pattern from uh, Fox and Rabbit. Karen made this pattern for us. And this is how I stitched it up. I st and I stitched it on 32 count flannel flowers from um, Fox and Rabbit. The chart has you stitch the white in here. Um, after I stitched the hand and everything, I didn't think it needed the white because I like the look of the fabric. So uh, take your, you know. And we were running the time too. Yeah, I, I we see. are running out of yeah. time. And uh, it's all DMC, except for the the martini here. We uh, we use the Classic Color Works, and I like the name of this color. It's called Creeping Jenny. And I said, wouldn't Frank drink a Creeping Jenny? <laughs> it just sounds spooky, like a spooky drink. A nice little eyeball in there. Everybody love it. Yeah, and we just popped this in an 8x10 frame, so it... It's like a regular standard size on 32 counts, mm -hmm. which is, mm -hmm. you know, which is kind of nice. <laughs> Ronnie, Ronnie did the lacing for me. He, he's and there we, the, do the, and we did the, the thread, thread pack, pack too. Mm -hmm. All the pretty colors. All the four designs, we do the thread pack. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Rami created this design for us. It's called Stitching in the Wild. And she had it stitched for us and, and sent it to us from Italy. Yes. Look at those cute little monsters. I love them. And what she did for us is she made, um, she did uh, half skeins of her mm -hmm. floss for, so this it, chart. for this chart. So it's not full skein. So um, normally when you buy her colors, you get more thread. So that's why I just wanted people to know, like, the reason you didn't get as much thread is because she halved it for us so that it would. And we priced it the same. Priced it uh, relative to the price, to the amount of floss you got. Yes. So I love this piece. Again, this is in um, is this an eight by ten? It looks like. And Linda, no, this is a European design. <coughs> Linda, right. one there are ten. This she made this one for the exchange. For the small exchange, right there in yeah. the in the. Yeah. Because let me she, pop a picture right here and you on. keep talking. She forgot the what? Huh? I'm gonna pop the picture in. Oh, there it is. All right. That's the only she, way to she forgot the the her her uh, exchange and yeah. home sitting on the and table. She was so I want to do it. I want to do it, and mm -hmm. then she do the the exchange and turn beautiful. Yeah. Yes. I was like, I love it. It's perfect. You know, it was meant to be, and that's all that matters. Yes. Okay. Now the exclusive design from um, Ink Circles. We. Um, because we are a little oh, OCD, okay. we we made we we were we asked the designers please give us all the information up front so that we could order the fabric and the floss and make the oh, kits. The so it, it fell inside. Oh. <laughs> That's the, all right. Okay. So as he's doing that, I'll show you what the pattern. Is. This is called um, Sand and Sun by Ink Circles. Look at that. She did it on. She stitched this one and we had it framed. So it would be a framed piece there. And it's uh, stitched with um, classic color works threads and Wichelt fabric um, touch of peach. Nice. We had a couple people at the retreat stitch this on, it was someone stitching it on blue. And then Stephanie started hers on green, which is a very pretty green that I will be getting. <laughs> yeah. We do these uh, packs and uh and we do individuals in yeah. case until gary no we cannot do all all kitted mm -hmm. because some people probably go one day only the chart or only the chart in the threads yeah. or you know yeah we we, yeah. we did it multiple ways we we did it <laughs> priced it we we kitted it up and then we sold them pieces individually so like if someone liked just the fabric this, ooh, I like that fabric. I can use it for a different project. Yes. You know, for example, like this. Yeah. <laughs> Go, going back to the to the um, freebies, mm -hmm. because we do a lot of kit threads, and we contact our designers, 
and asking permission to because this this uh, free freebies mm -hmm. was meant to for the stitching in the wild to the stitching in the wild retreat. Yeah. And because we have all the threads and the designs are beautiful. Mm -hmm. For me are beautiful. Yeah. These little designs are beautiful. And we asking permission to sell the thread. And if people like the I'm sorry. If people like the chart when they see us and other people stitch it, if they like the chart, we can send in the chart for free and sell in okay. the thread. All right. He, he's a little choked up. <laughs> I mean, okay. So, okay. so he what, is yeah. explainer. Yeah. So we we asked the designers if 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 we could, well, when we sell the thread pack, if we could provide the people with a hard copy of the pattern that was free for Stitching the Wild. And Stitchy Pros, Rami's Creations, and Fox and Rabbit, all three said, yes, you, you can do that. That is fine. We thank you for asking us, and we really appreciate it. So we will be selling the thread packs, these thread packs. If you want the chart. And you can buy the thread pack without the chart. But oh well, yes. So the thread pack. No. Uh, when you buy the thread pack, you will get the free chart. We're not going to email the chart. We're not going to um, uh, give you just the chart. You have to buy the thread pack to get yes. the chart. So that's the stipulation. So um, and we wanted to make sure because we get free. You get free charts all the time. How many times do you stitch them? Mm -hmm. And we wanted to break the rules and break the mold of. There's a freebie. Let's stitch it. And that is my idea. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I made I made here stitch yeah. the because the... I don't know how many freebies I have stacked up waiting for one day. But when you see the model, when you see it stitched, you want to stitch it more than just seeing a paper. So let's get back to that with that one. Okay. All right. So now because... he's he's leaving me. Wait, no. It's another freebie. We forgot to show it. All right. Okay. Another freebie. This was the one that done by Salty Stitcher. Salty Stitcher. She she designed. Oh, that was for Give me. me that. That was mine. Yeah. She designed our logo as a cross stitch pattern. I stitched it. It took me a while. It took eight skeins of black. I was supposed to stitch it. But... I stitched it on Ada, and we had the attendees put their initials at the retreat. So this is. Our logo with uh, over oh, with the, there we go. This is our logo um, that um, Salty Stitcher um, designed, turned into a cross stitch pattern, and then I had a free alphabet chart from Yarn Tree, and everyone stitched their initials in one of the six rainbow colors that Ronnie had on the floss draw. So yeah. everyone, I think I'm pretty sure everyone stitched, almost everyone almost everyone yeah pretty sure. It's quite a bit of signatures yeah. on there. It went, <coughs> this went Excuse out me. the first day of the retreat and everybody, and it was going through the whole four days, which was great. Yeah. And the fabric is 16 count spellbound by fab, by uh, Under the Seas fabric. And we put it in the, in the roller frame mm -hmm. and it was around, around, around. Yeah, it kept moving. And there the ladies is there. Oh, she's leaving. She need to go next. And she's leaving. She can go next. And that way, pass through mm -hmm. almost every hand yeah. in the in the in the in retreat. The that was very nice. And then, mm -hmm. so so we did the ink sort of one. Now let's go to the Teresa Kogut. Teresa Kogut did us a design as well, and I had it framed and I stitched this one. This is uh, sunshine and bloom, and bloom sunshine and blooms, and it's. It was such a fun stitch. We, so I ordered the fabric from x -Jude, which was in Hungary. So we had to order this well in advance. We got it in multiple counts of Ada, multiple counts of linen. And we made up the kits. And we still have yeah. some of the kits and some of the individual fabrics left. Yeah. So it's a grandma slip. And the threads are a DMC and Classic Color Works. And Week Dye Works. Oh, and One Week's Dye Works. Uh, some, I, I saw someone... Uh, there was a video, I think Carolyn, I think Cezuk Stitch said that she was thinking about putting Stitching in the Wild under here instead of the Sunshine and Blooms. So she was thinking of putting Stitching in the Wild so she would remember this piece is from Stitching Wild. That's a good idea. I did not even think about that, but I love the idea. And when I stitched this, I couldn't put it down. It's a really good design to stitch. I, I just get it. I love this piece. 
Yeah. Yeah. And so. And I'm pushing him to do it too. He didn't have to push me to put, do this one. I'm like, oh, I got to, I got to stitch that. Uh, right. But yeah. for the model, for mm -hmm. have the model in the table. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and this is when a lady who bring, I don't know who was. Karen. 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 Karen M. Oh, was her? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, from Georgia. Um, from Georgia. He doesn't know what Karen M. I'm talking about because we had two. <laughs> <laughs> well, she bring them bunch of stickers, and I go there and I got it. I have it some in my wallet, but I got it this one, and then put it in my husband. Um, with project, mm -hmm. and. We coming back home and I found it and I say, oh, do you know who put this one in your, in your, okay, let me see. Is your, okay, this one say, every love is, story is beautiful, but art is my favorite. Mm. And I said, do you know who put this one in your house? <laughs> say, I know I did. <laughs> <laughs> say, who more? Every time I walked away, every time I come back, there was so much love. Yes, so much love at the retreat. And the ladies was so kind and generous. I was shocking me because I'm not expecting. Mm -hmm. And we had tons of presents. Very, a lot I, of presents. I never even expected. It was complete shock. I'm yeah. like, we're, oh. here, we're here to... Oh. Oh my God! To offer you guys the stitching event. I mean, I did, yeah. You wasn't... should, you should, you just, you don't know how to do that. Yeah. Because only your presence was enough for me. Yeah. But thank you so much for all these goodies. Mm -hmm. And here and we go. And we may, may or may not remember who, where, when, what. No. Uh, we do, we will put some pictures at the end of people that we did find. And, and take, take pictures, pictures of yes so um i think i i don't know it was it was a Names whirlwind coming in my head and gone because yeah. i was so mm -hmm. hyper yeah. my adrenaline was from day one till monday mm -hmm. monday we got right home we crashed monday we crashed crash because you know it was the, the 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 brain doesn't remember the names or or the conversations vaguely but the heart it's all tied into the heart the heart all everything that happened over the weekend is stuck in my heart and that's the feel that i took away from stitching in the wild yeah this is a uh, kathy f bring me this this uh folder mm -hmm. full of uh patriotic, patriotic goodies okay i don't even go there yet Oh, yeah. I, don't, I don't go there yeah. yet. Okay, and um, but I will sit down one day and and go through it. Go through it. So there's um, some good ones in there. This this lady so sweet. Um, she bring this to. Oh, her name is here. No, no. no. Her daughter have a fat chocolate factory. I'm thinking of a chocolate store. And she bring us these two yummy, yummy, yummy. Yeah. It, it took a lot not to flamingos. eat these. Flamingos. Mine is flamingo. Mine's a gator. Yeah. Yeah. Flamingo and gator. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. It's the Chocolate Company 5150 Bean and Bar. Yeah. yeah. This guy's her daughter's. Her daughter's shop? Okay. Yeah. Her daughter's shop. Um, this is a quilted blanket i've been using this every night since i got home yeah because I, I, I like to i like to have a blanket on me when i'm stitching no matter how hot it is it's just just kind of cozy oh god her name um she say it's for both of you but guess what <laughs> <laughs> it's mine yeah anyway i never watching oh tv god, it's gorgeous i never oh, watching tv in the living room yeah so I'm always with my babies. I, I my love the, the the colors, the tones, the colors. Yeah, it's not bright, and, bright, but it's look at this. all pumpkins. And the the quilting is stars and moons. Yes, definitely, definitely. Um, it's beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> thank you. And he enjoying a lot. Uh, Money maker, Meg. Shelly, Shelly. Uh huh. She made this one for me. 
Uh huh. And she made this one for me. Oh my god! Look how much work. That's surely Halloween. And Who it's got knows? like it's got like a magnet closure. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And it's um like a fold like yeah. um like a folder. It's a lot of yeah. space have here for the project. And can you use it in the retreat for that's a yeah. Uh, what is it called? Like a placemat? Placemat. Oh, it's very pretty. Yeah, the <gasps> people. Oh, I've never seen that kind of fabric before. Yeah. That's that gorgeous. Yeah. Flowers, patriotic. She. She She got us. She got she, me. Yeah, she got she us. Got Halloween me. and patriotic flowers. Yeah. Thank you, Shelly. Then, uh, Marja, I'm thinking she's naked because she gave me one. And I got one. And he got one. These are Stroop waffles from Netherlands. Yeah. Okay. Food's gonna have to go over there. <laughs> These ones is from uh, De Debbie. Deb. Yep. Deb. And these are little Ort. Okay. She knitted these little Ort. Everybody. She, oh my gosh. She just knitted, knitted, knitted. Everybody love it. Yeah. In my mind, I think everybody got a green one, but I thought there was some, oh, I thought there was some random blue ones. No. She made green for you, and she said she made me one, but it's on way Oh, yeah. In my mind, everybody got a green one. Mm, <laughs> I don't know. She made multiple colors. Oh, uh, it's gorgeous. And she passed it. I like this yep. little bag with candy. Love the candy. Okay. This is Marja. This is from the Netherlands. She gave me this. I don't know Marja. what is mine. Mine um, is around here. It's a cheese pen with the Netherlands flag on it. Oh my go. I thought they were known for tulips. <laughs> I, I... Jackie passed this scissor focus. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it says oh. S. It says S T S I. No, what? A stitching in the wall. Yeah, stitching in the wall. S I. S I T W 2023. And I told her, yeah. I said, you know what, Jackie? Now we need a four to add on the end of it for for next year. <laughs> she worked in that. Uh, in she made the, these at the retreat. At the retreat. Yeah. yeah. With the help of Miss Costa Rica, how she yeah, do. Yeah, Laura helped her uh, string the beads. They they were sitting there beating. They were sitting there stringing beads and beating. We were, well, others were stitching. I was running my mouth, but. Yeah, wow. Laura was, is, Laura is from Costa Rica. And she made a scissor fog in the back. I don't know what happened at this one, but and she made this little with Costa Rican candies. Costa Rica flag and Costa Rica's candies. And she put her name and her um uh estate. <laughs> and I don't see as the phone number there. I, she put I, it up. I, I, hopefully oh, you can see it. I found it. Marja give me this pen. With the tulip and the flag. Yeah. Isn't pretty. And say this is the baby tulip because she sent us a in wood. the past a long tulip, wood, wood tulip. With chocolates. And she gave me that one with the little tulip. I said, oh, she gave me the baby tulip. <laughs> I had the mama and now I had the baby. Yeah. Uh, I remember this one is, I think it was nice, Nancy. Mm -hmm. She said, I see your. Um, I have put the answer your videos. Thank you, Nancy. Thank you, everybody. But full of my candy. His favorite strawberry candy. Uh, yes. I had candy for years. The, years. <laughs> and I don't remember somebody give me a I I do you remember who yes, I Yes, that was Donna. Donna. Thank you, Donna. I have very have one and I have one. Mm -hmm. This is from Dina. Dina. Because she's on there. Dina passed. I just. With Coco. Yep. Look at the little, little floss heart. Strokes. A yeah. beautiful heart here. I know that's a cool idea, isn't it? With yeah, a little heart. I like that I heart. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. There we have. This is from. I don't know who was it. I. Oh. Some of this stuff I'm just now seeing. Uh, oh. Band-Aids? Yeah, that was a joke about the Band-Aids. Was this Donna band as well? I don't remember. Donna and Dina? They give me this. Oh no, this is Maria. <laughs> See, this 
is very smart. Oh my gosh. Yes, I love okay. it. Many of these things we don't open to now. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. Because I was hear... focusing on the people at the retreat. Did you hear me? Oh my God. It's the first time I see it. Look, that. Stitching in the wall. And this one had elephant. Oh, you too? Yeah. This yeah. one had elephants. I it's, love it's it. It's a corner gauge, so it's got the holes there. Yes. Wow, that's really cool. Yes. So yeah. she's oh, she's got her information there. Uh, and all the information. Okay. I love it. See, that this oh. is this is takeaway for me. Like when I do when we do things, we need to have our information on there. Yeah. That's a good idea. One of the things the one share with you guys is around 50% of the attendees, they was first retreat. Yes. And I was, what, what, what? Yes. I'm thinking this one was there. Um, I don't know. It was, it I was there when I come her. back. We and, take and, a picture. I'm thinking we, we take, take a, picture? a picture with her. All yes. right. So they stitched this for yes. me. Yeah, like now, I, I'm almost positive it was there. Oh, yeah. Okay. But, yeah, she did that for you. I don't know about the banding. See, you only need a little piece of banding. Turn it the other way. See, it, it, the banding normally goes like this. And then when you turn it the other way, you can make your own little piece. Isn't that cute? Yes. I love thinking outside the box. Very that hang is this clever. Up. That is yeah, very clever. unique for me. I gotta hang that up. This baggie was Gina. Mm -hmm. and, oh. And, oh, okay. I have another bag. You keep showing her phone number. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. <gasps> oh, wow. Nobody goes for money to cook Costa Rica. She make these scissor fogs with the Costa Rica flag. It's very cute. I have a key for my heart and a butterfly. Mm -hmm. That was Miss Costa Rica, Laura. We say Miss Costa Rica all the all, all retreat. All right, so this is from, oh, this is from Gina. Gina. Mm -hmm. And look at this, it's got turtle little pins. I love these little shaker box things. I don't know why I'm got it. He's got this. all kinds of stuff in his bag. Oh, these and bracelets they, and the, are... That's from the sisters. Okay, leaving the here. Mm. And then there's where there's candies in there. Mm. Let me see, let me see mine. Oh, I'm thinking that one is mine. Oh, this one's Halloween. See, Gina, yeah. Gina we messed it up. <laughs> but see that my bag, yeah. I messed it up. This one is mine, and that is Gary's. I can oh, tell they're Jack gorgeous. Leonard. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Gina. It's like a little spider web on top. And I have candy, more candy. Mm -hmm. What is your candy? Oh, it's back in the bag. Oh, I have more candy. Mm -hmm. I love these, these are so cute. Yeah, uh, put it back in the bag and then we, yeah, and then we, can, we can put it up. I got a place, I got a place for all this stuff. Yeah. There, this one was with a cutie car from Texas car, Nancy. Oh, Nancy? Oh. Yeah, oh, Nancy so give pretty. me that one too. She made this one for me, special for me. Mm. Oh, okay. Looking how cute. Oh. She know I love Texas. The blue bonnets. And she made me the blue bonnets. She crusted the blue bonnet for me. Oh. Thank you, Nancy. That's very pretty. Yeah, it you is. Hang it up. Like that. Yeah. Okay. Put it in the bag in there so you know where. It... Yeah. I don't know where this one. And we have here. I'm uh, thinking this one, one is, is from mine. their sisters. <laughs> no. I'm calling the twins. Uh, no, this is somebody else. What is the this twins? This is from Linda. Oh. Sorry. Yeah, Linda um, is the one who stitched the smalls. Oh, for the, for okay. the This is Linda. And yeah. as you can tell, I think we might have a theme. Look at that. 
side. It's got the little witch. Look at the little witch button on there. And there's one on each side. I don't know how picture we end up with this one. No? I don't remember, but look at mine. Look at my as beautiful. Oh, it's a beautiful she card. Please take her time to do it. Oh, oh wow. Very lovely card. I have to we have to sit and read this together later. Yes. Thank you, Linda. Thank you, Linda. I'm sorry if I don't take picture with you. I think we did that. The pictures. I, I know one thing. I hugged everybody at least twice. I think you had no more than twice. Yeah. Yeah. But, oh my god, this is so cool. We have a wonderful one. Okay. okay. Um this bag is from uh Dina. Dina yes. gave us this bag. Mm -hmm. This one uh, her friend Donna did this arts or oh, no, this uh yeah, it's this an one. art. Mm -hmm. I don't remember how to open it. Collapse, collapsible thread casher. Yeah. Like that. And here is the instructions how to open it. Yeah, you just twist it up and yeah. get back in there. Yeah. That's so cute. Thank you. That's a lot of work. That's a lot of yeah. work. I have more cards from Dina. Uh-huh. I can put these with the put others. Put that together. Okay. And they make this beautiful place already. Stitching mats. Stitching mats. So you can, so and it's just got like little pockets to put your floss and stuff in there. Looking how gorgeous. And scissors. This is Ronnie's because it's not green. Yeah. And they're for your needles. For your needles. Mm -hmm. And they're that one. That one is gorgeous. Yeah. That's for your thread. Yeah. You put your threads on the ring and then you pull <laughs> them down inside here. So they don't get tangled up when you have them and then you mm -hmm. put them back in here and uh the cars i have plenty of cars this is gary's no, this is ronnie's this is yours yeah. looking that oh yeah there's the little the little book with the green felt you put your needles what needles you're using yeah and then this is the fruit that they see they know what you're talking about. <laughs> that is yours. Yeah. Uh, that is your pull it out. And then I love these. I don't know how oh, they the ring is here. Yeah. I don't know how she knew I love these, but these are one of my favorite candies. Yeah. And food goes over there. We have the cars are all everywhere. Yeah. These are say congrats. Uh -huh. Oh, I have one a car. I forgot to pull it out. The one the lady sent us. Oh, I, I don't know where I'm putting it, but I'll show you next video. Okay. She sent me a. She sent us a warming card for the move. Oh. Okay. Yeah, and I forgot. I don't know where I'm putting it. That we have. Okay. This beautiful for that from is Dina? the card from Dina. Uh huh. I'm gonna put this with the so we can remember. Yeah, here the envelope. Okay. That is mine. Uh -huh, and that's your. That's mine. And this is yours. Yeah. This yeah. is Dina and Donna. Mm -hmm. Pretty cars. Pretty. All the time the ladies took to write the letters and and write the cards you and see, stuff. I have one envelope empty. I don't know where the card go. Maybe it's the congrats card right here, look. Yeah. I, oh. I think it fits. Yes, it is. Mm. Um, this is, these uh, were needle minders. From Grace. Grace. Grace Zoo. And I see in the video, the Jackie mm -hmm. or Caroline, and say, this is the crown. From the logo of Garon from the stitchery. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she yeah, Grace was telling me that. Yeah. It's so clever. It's so it's a needle minder too. And uh you open it up and you can put your threads. Yeah. 
you can use for your thread and your needle minder. Um, I can find this one, but this one is for Gary, a present from, this was a present from Stephanie, and it's called uh, Ice Goddess. Isn't that gorgeous? <clears throat> I'm gonna do my winter white Santa on this piece. Isn't he? It's, it's gonna be gorgeous on there. This is uh, because every time we every time we were getting ready to open and every time we're getting ready to close, I kept watching this piece of fabric and I was looking at it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This was was uh, Bridget and Sarah. Bridget was the mother, is the mother, and Sarah is the daughter. Mm -hmm. They made these little thread books. Hitties. Yeah, thread or needles. Needle, needle books. Sorry, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking needle. I'm my, crazy. I'm thinking needle, but my mouth is saying thread. <laughs> okay, this was uh, bring it. She, I think she made for everybody in the table. Yeah, she made for her table mates, and There's she made one. us. Yeah, but this one is for us. <gasps> Look at the scissors, Ronnie. She look in this. She make. Uh, I don't know. If you can see it. This one say Ronnie. Art and a little bitty scissors. I love it. This is a go with me. Yeah, and this one, look at the pumpkin. Yeah, this one says Gary. I like the little, and they fit my fingers. Sometimes the little scissors, the, the holes are too little. Yeah, she had the scissors. Okay, this one is for the scissors. Oh, is that? She put her, what is this? It's lotion you can use that won't, it's not oily for your Hand stitching. Hand cream. Yeah, some, some lotions you can't use it, but this one you can. She put her a needle minder, a sewing machine for me. Mm -hmm. A little bat for me. She put her for frogging. Oh, I, yeah, I, I, I didn't know what this was for. It's for frogging. What's that? What's frogging? I don't know. What is this tool? It's a it's a tweezers. Oh. You have one for your sewing machine. Remember you when you thread your yeah, but this, mine's are different. This one feels really strong. Ooh, I'm using it in my yeah. sewing room. She gave us this was Jackie. Yeah. yeah, she knows she his favorite us... color is black, and mine is green. Black BMCs, and these and... are these are peels you put on the Valdani balls to keep them from. Um, Unthreading. Oh. Yeah. Okay. And she gave me a oh I don't know what eighteen count yeah. fabric. And and this is thirty two. Oh wait, this is simpler. This is Caroline? No, Caroline put this in here. Oh. I think. No. I'm confusing now. This was Jackie or Caroline. No. I thought this was Jackie. This is, yeah. This is what uh, Caroline, Caroline Pass. I will remember you are so love it. This yeah. is what Caroline Pass. See what I mean? The retreat brain is Oh my wrong. God, girls. Just have a good it's, time. Have a good time yes. is all you can do. This is so. And, and you know, the, the blessing. The back is Jackie. The, bless, I remember the blessings are sorry, are, Jackie. Are overwhelming. Well, you meet me. You know I'm a little crazy. A lot. <laughs> All right. This is from Holly and, and her, her mama. mama. Um, and I had to restrain wait. myself very a this lot. This is a lovely, beautiful card. Oh, this is. Um, Cindy and Holly. Mm -hmm. Is this present? Yeah. And I can believe this. When they come in this bag and say, what they're thinking? So Holly's mom is a retired baker. She had her own shop, I believe. And she made these lemon uh, biscotti. They're so good. And everyone, oh my God. Okay, I'm not gonna eat. I'm not gonna eat on the video. I won't do that. And they can have beautiful, but they yeah. can have beautiful. Yeah. So I now I can eat these for breakfast. I did eat. I did snag two of them. And uh, I have to stand down. Sorry. Because I don't want broken. 
Are you ready, guys? Gary picture. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Frankenstein cookie jar. And it's full of goodies. Um, these are some teas. Some teas. And these little little tea... Um, I, I don't know. What are they? Tea balls? So I was telling... Ronnie, I was telling Holly's mom and Holly that um, Heartstring Samplery came out with a pattern that you stitch on these little things. So you can stitch on these. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that. Yeah, so. Yeah, and they stitch in the big ones too. Yeah, the big ones too. And yeah. this is full of Ronnie's candy and my candy. It's half full for Gary and yeah. half for me. Yeah, so that yeah. will that will sit next to my stitching table starting tonight. Yeah. I have to take one. Yeah, that is so. Beautiful. Oops. Okay, this doesn't come out. What is this one? Tea. Oh, the tea. Yes. Oh, so cute. So cute. So cute. Oh. I am so. Now, this one is one for Gary. Oh, okay. One thing I'm giving you two is this one. Oh, this is from the hotel staff. No. Yeah, that one. Ah! Yeah. I got it. I have it here. So, this is. Okay, this is tell you how Jessica she wasn't the the, the, salesperson. the salesperson we started with but she's the salesperson we ended with yes and she was very attentive yeah but, but no was her was somebody in the staff or oh, the staff the staff okay well yeah. look they did a thank you card with a button and thread it's not a hotel logo I mean they went above and beyond yes yeah and there was a, a little jar of mints and stuff which I cleaned out when we left. Because it was more candy. Yeah. <laughs> that oh. was the one of the stuff. Yes. And this is from... This is from Kathleen. Look at that. Look at the dragonfly. Look at mine. That's cute. Yeah. It's stitched. Is, is it stitched? Made. So, so Kathleen ha got oh, me wow. some Gloriana. Oh, Look, it's called Halloween Green. Is that not appropriate? And then a thread key. Oh, look at that thread. Oh, wow. It's like a witch yeah. and an owl. Cousin. I'm in love with the card. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. And she make. I love these little things. Yeah. This is jewelry for stitching. Yeah. I'm, uh, mine is here. A little heart. Is that what it is? Yeah. A heart. Gorgeous. Thank I hope this you. is okay. I mean, I hope everyone's okay with this because we don't know how else to to really thank everyone. Yeah. You know, it it's it's just so overwhelming and and lovely. As yeah, really, we don't, we don't expect all these goodies, and we are very very thankful. Yeah. I have to because frame that card. It's, Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. And this one, this car coming in the mail before we leave. Oh, yes. And say, just because, hold on. Just because. And oh, it's, so a, uh, um, it's another handmade card. It's made by hair. Yeah. Lean. Mm -hmm. Lean from Alabama. Alabama. Yep. Oh, thank you, neighbor. <laughs> yeah, but she's so sweet. She says, it's late, but it's here. And I say, no, it's, I'm not thinking it's never as late. Never thank late. you so much for your kindness. And we got these two little baggies. They are really lemon ginger mm -hmm. tea. Oh, this is a tissue. This is tissue pros. This is tissue pros. Because she passed it in, in her. Um, ooh, 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 ooh. This is the Amazon honey candy that Ronnie loves. It helps with his coughing. I'm ready for one. Yeah. Thank you. Look at this beautiful. Oh, look. Okay, she, she's taken the thread drops to a higher level. Name, number, 
and brand. I never even thought about putting that on the back of the thread drops. Yeah. This, yeah, and look at the scissors. Oh my gosh, I'm like, oh, they got the little thing on them. Oh my, this one. Look at those, those are so cool. Wow, and that one had a lot of scissors. Yeah. Look at this one. This is cool. It, it's got the, the cap on it. I know, I know, go up in it. And then this is the scissor fob. With the honey, mm -hmm. mine have honey. Yeah. Honeycomb? Yeah. Thank you, Holly. Wow. Lemon ginger, that's probably good mm, for you. My family. All right. This is yours. <laughs> I, I, I'm more of chocolate anyway. But it's good. Yes. Oh, wow. All right. Okay. Now, we have three more to go. This one. Oh. Okay. I don't remember why it's yours. I think this is yours. Yours is red. That's mine. Yeah. This is from the sisters. Um, and, and their name this is Diane. Diane. Yep. And Diane. And is, isn't it cool? It's like a, a Halloween tomato and a strawberry. She handmade these. I mean, this is gorgeous work. And the little pin there. Mine is in a strawberry. Mm -hmm. Oh, a little glass dish there. It's cool. I love oh, these colors. See, oh, Diane. Yeah, Diane. Diane Maker, yes. Mm -hmm. And um, Diane gave us these. Her husband made these for us because he. She said he watches us, and he made us these um, miracle braids or something like that, and put a little crown on the end of it. Yeah. So because they're not cut, so they're braided. But how do you braid them on the ends? There's a way to braid them. It's, and it's these are, either. she said these are luggage tags. How am I going to put it on my luggage? Yeah. I don't know how to do it. Find something to. I don't know how to do it, but I don't know. I have to find a it. Halloween piece and frame it, frame them with it. That'd yeah. be cool. It's a handmade. Mm -hmm. And now, uh, oh. That, I don't know. I'm thinking it's her. Hmm. Okay, hold on. Let me see something. Because I'm not sure it was her. Oh, there's a card. Nope. Cards are important. Nope. No. Nope. This is what the um, lady dot. Yeah. I'm sorry, but this is beautiful, but I don't remember. I know oh, it's made. You you see this video and you do. Please let us know. Let us know. Yeah, I'm not even thinking I have a picture. It's a shepherd's. It's a shepherd's bush. Yeah. Is it for you, or did they put it in there by mistake? No. Then somebody handed it to me. Oh, okay. And I was so. I'm putting in bags, and I put. I have one box empty the, from the bags, mm -hmm. and I just have put it there. The goodies they give me. And mm -hmm. some was mixed, mixing. All right. Very pretty. This one. This is This one is the sisters. Uh, this is from um, um yeah, Julie, the Julia. And they made yeah. stitching in the wild. Julie mini bags. Julia. Yeah, Julia. Julia C. Yeah. And thread drops. And then we did this one. These are the playing card. They did playing card thread drops. I don't know how they did that. Oh, she make a, that one. She make, look at this. Yeah, they're, those are patriotic That's ones. That's cool. Garden forever. Yeah. So it says, it says uh, Stitching in the Wild, 2023, Garon. And this was, a, this is a picture of her smalls from the Smalls Exchange. This was her small that she gave Yes, yeah. she designed that. And uh, her sister, I think her sister designed the other one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. She designed both. And she did the logo of Garon Stitchery. Which we will. And she gave everybody. Picture there. Yeah, she contacted us like months before and said if she could, you know, take our logo and change a little bit and and, and stitch it and pass and, it out. And, and called, I said, sure. I called the twins because yeah. they are so sweet. 
with twins. I, I, for me, they're they sisters. Are no, they are no twins, but I'm calling the twins yeah. because they are same aptitude, same yeah. karma, same. Yeah. You so can sweet. feel the love. Yeah. yeah. And um, when you look at the card, they, you know how they got these little cards, and then there's G, and they wrote my the rest of my name, and then they did. There's, they found the R and did Ronnie. That is yeah. that so sweet. The detail. Yeah. Thank wow. you so so the very handmade much. items are so beautiful. I'm thinking that was it. All right. The all the goodies. All we the goodies. Got. Wow. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. God bless every everyone. <laughs> yes. Everyone. This was mm -hmm. overwhelming. Yeah. So um, do we want to? We want to? We will be doing. A stitching in the wild in 2024. We already have one designer. We have a few designers already lined up. I've oh, been, I've, oh, you're not done with the other one. I have like a couple, more than more than two. Okay. So I have quite a bit of designers signed up for either trunks shows or exclusives. I'm yeah. still working out the stuff. Um, it will be in Alabama this time because this is where we live. Makes it a little bit easier. And it will be the weekend after Mother's Day and the weekend before Memorial Day, whatever that sandwich is. So we will be hunting and scouting hotel event scenes. Uh, we are, we brought back some bags and some mini bags. Oh, yes. And some uh, itsy bitsy bags. A little bitty bags. They so, I, make, I make a little batch. Mm -hmm. And whatever is left, I already posted yep. in the yep. and, and Grime Guards. The website. It's not too many. Uh, too many or anything. Yeah, but we thought we would uh, do a little. It's not a crazy sale, so it's a little bit of sale out there. We just kind of snuck it in out there. So if you're watching the video, or you're you're on the website, go take a look and um, have yeah. a relaxed shopping event for for the first time with Garron bags. Yeah, <laughs> everything for me was unexpected, and you know, I expect just a couple of bags sale mm -hmm. and a couple of green cars. Yeah. And, but every, everything go the, unexpected. You know, I, I really, really want to uh, thank Kathy so much. She helped me immensely. Kathy F. Kathy F. One Kathy F. Kathy F. Number one. Kathy F. W. Oh. Halloween. Okay. <laughs> H. H is Halloween. Oh. Oops. <laughs> All right. So, so I was, while I was busy. I using, know you go laughing yeah. with this one. Yeah. While I was doing the, the checkout, she was there helping me next to me. Uh you know, taking care of the people. And I know she, you know, she's got a lot of retail experience and I know she looks, she saw me look up and she thought I was panicking and was, was fear, but it really was, I, I just was so ecstatically shocked that um, the, the line was down around, all the way around the room and it was almost close to the door, but not quite. At first, I thought they were just people looking at the tables, and then I realized they all had their stuff and they were in line. I'm like, wow, it's real. You know, it's like we have a store, you know, because we're used to dealing with we the have online. For three days, stuff. but we had a store. We had a store. Now nobody days. can say we never had a store. Yeah. So it was, it was so nice. And, and then, of course, I'm, I'm looking over there behind it, Stephanie, and she's over there texting. <laughs> <laughs> like and she's got her line of people there too so it was like oh wow this is how it feels on the other side you know i'm normally i'm the one standing in line just because what you do in line when you're standing in line you're talking to people you're meeting people you're enjoying so um that's all i had to say on that yeah that's that's good that's mm -hmm. good that's good i was running from the stitchery stitching room to the there and Try to help in and see what I can do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So that so, was. Yeah. So we got some some uh, little tweaks and stuff to do for the next one that um, will make it a little bit more fun experience. I think. But I'm excited to get started again. Yeah, and I'm thinking. You know, I'm thinking everybody enjoying it. I'm... All right, and now we're ready for the big announcement. Yes. We uh we had a. a raffle for uh at the event where we donated uh raised money for saint jude and uh, Schreiner. shriner's hospital Schreiner. and we took that money and we split it between the two and we've uh donated the money to those two organizations 
posting the pictures here. Yeah, thank you to all the girls who volunteered to sell the the tickets. Mm -hmm. And I don't say name because ha, my head is crazy, but I have a schedule for two at a time. <laughs> this is funny. I have a schedule for two at a time, uh, every 30 minutes. And when I'm looking at the table, I saw six people there. Yeah. They got the tickets and go in the tables and selling. And um, we have $100 donation from Fox directly and from Fox and Rabbit directly to St. Jude Children's Hospital. Uh -huh. And we raised $900 cash. Yes. And uh, we, Gary, go send in. Yep. And um, then. Right, and then Ronnie and I donated another 100, so it made it 1,100. Yeah, we're gonna do 500 mm -hmm. to Strenner, Strenner yes. Hospital and 500 to St. Jude yes. Children's Hospital. Thank you, everybody, yep. for your kindness. Yep. Thank you so much for support our uh, charities. Mm -hmm. And God bless you. Yeah. I think the only complaint we had about the raffle for Strenner's raising was that they ran out of tickets. Yes. They ran out of tickets, so they yeah. were just throwing money at the table. They just take the money. Yeah. <laughs> Every, yeah. You know, everyone is really grateful for a good charity that actually goes to the right place. Yes. And we want to thank everyone. It's it's really a meaningful char charity for us. Ronnie and I donate to that, to both charities every month. Mm -hmm. And every and Ronnie does his monthly, is um yearly, 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 <laughs> yearly birthday um, <sighs> charity. Um, oh, he's going to show the bag. Fox and Rabbit win one bag. Well, was one, I'm putting a set. This is the, the print for this, oh, for this year. St. Jude, St. St. Jude. Schreiner. This is the, the bag. Yeah. I have 50 years waiting for me. I'm not sure I'm going to do it the first, bef oh, I'm sorry. Before my birthday or after my birthday, yeah. but I had the fabrics. So we'll be doing that in August. So he's just giving you a preview of what the bag will look like. So don't get too excited. <laughs> <laughs> not yet, not yet. You can't order uh, it yet. <laughs> I will announce in the in the video when the bags are ready and what they go be. There is my girls. And but thank you, thank you, thank you, everybody yes, who participated. Thank you so much. All right. Mm -hmm. So uh, we've we've uh, got you guys held hostage for the last two hours. Hopefully you're still with us. Oh wow! Yeah, two hours. <laughs> yeah, I'm um, enjoying my candy. Yeah. So we will be back on our regular video schedule <laughs> next next. No, we won't. Will we? Yes. Anyway, we're going to go be going to StitchCon as our next event, but we're going as participants, so it's our little vacation. Yeah, I don't even know when it's. I don't know. It's. I think we had a week and another week. It, really? It's, it's like the week of the seventh. Okay. Seventh of June. I don't know. So what it's day almost it's about today. a week. <laughs> yeah, I'm. I'm still kind of confused what day it is. Um, well, we going to StitchCon. Mm -hmm. The bag of the the clubs. Now no, only bag of the month. The clubs invoices going out this Sunday. Yeah. So we will be shipping Sunday and Monday. Yeah, and we have Zoom this Sunday. Yes. If you see this video tonight or tomorrow Saturday, we go. We'll have the the Zoom on Sunday Memorial Weekend Zoom. Mm -hmm. Yes, and I think it was. It was very fun. It was very fun because we had a lot of our people from Zoom at the retreat. It was yeah. so. It was so cool seeing people in person. <laughs> yes. And I need a, a sorry for the, we didn't do the video last weekend, but was, we said we would try. We was trying, but yeah. was impossible. Yeah. So we're not, we're not going to even the time was try going. to commit to one while we're at StitchCon. We know now we weren't able to do it at, at um, Nashville when we thought we would, we weren't able to do it at StitchCon, but we thought we could do it at our event because we could kind of control it, but there's a whole different world that you're involved in. So yeah. all we can do is when we come back is give a nice, long, fun um, follow-up catch-up video. Yeah. I think that's the best the best thing to do, and it's really enjoyable. So we can reflect on yeah. all the loveliness, oh. just um, reflecting on everything. 
Yep. I'm just in shock. I mean, who knew three years ago that we would be able to mm -hmm. do this? I'm, do I'm this blessed. Event. I'm blessed and grateful every time. And I'm thinking we say all. Oh. Yes, we have. Thank you, yeah. Thank you, guys. She knows. Love. Love you. Bye bye. Well, guys, this is the night before we start setting out for stitching in the wild. This is down at the bottom of the hotel. Look at that. We got eight floors. And everyone is all asleep waiting for tomorrow for us to start working. Okay, this is just a little bit of what's going on here. Here we go to this store. It's opening today. You see the people are going to be in line. <laughs> I, I just have it to <laughs> Here's all the girls waiting in line. <laughs> Who's the first one? 
People are here. Okay, I'm going to do it a little video. Hi, Stephanie. Oh, my. <laughs> I say to Michael for me, he yellows. Hi, Michael. Wish <laughs> you could be here. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh, oh, is he a foster family? No. <laughs> Our other school dog. Our other school dog. Frankie is five years old. Hi, Miss Sook. Hello. Hi. 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 From are you Sarah. Putting, are you putting them in inside or are you going to put them on the outside? You can put them wherever you want. Oh, okay. I don't know. <laughs> That's why I'm asking. Hello everyone, uh, welcome to our floss tube for this week. We are at uh, Stitching in the Wild in Florida and we thought we'd pull a little bit of uh, people together. This is the last day, so <laughs> we are a bit out of breath. Um, so um, that's Ronnie, I'm Gary, Hi, yeah. I'm and, Ronnie. and we're the House of Girl Wrong. <laughs> oh, now you confuse me. <laughs> um, no, oh my god. <laughs> Sorry. The house of Garanto bags. Okay. All right. Okay, so let's introduce the, the Garan panel. <laughs> so at first we have... I'm Carolyn from Cezuck Stitch. Carolyn has uh, helped us out a lot when we have our market sale. She's done those amazing videos where she shows you 
how to look at things on our website, which is, we really appreciate it. And we want to give her a big thank you and really acknowledge all the hard work and many hours that she puts in these, those videos, because we all know how long they take. Yes, thank you, sweetheart. Thank you, Carolyn. Thank you. And then next to us, we have Dina, half stitch, cross stitch. Yeah. And uh, I always tell her I can listen to her speak all night long. And she says, well, you have. You stitch with me till midnight. That's <laughs> true. <laughs> so I met Dina at StitchCon first year. And now we spent all night this weekend stitching. stitching. Yes. It was great. Had a good time. And then uh, we have Holly, the designer from Stitchy Pros. She, sti she designed our Frankenstein pattern for us for the Halloween box last year. And uh, she's a, one of our guest designers here at the at the show. She's an attendee, but we have her trunk show here. So everyone's enjoyed seeing her brand new releases that she released for us at this retreat. So you'll see it released fully. It'll be this summer. So the attendees got the first viewing of my new patterns for the summer and they'll hit the rest of the shops in the upcoming weeks. Yep. They're great. Yes, they, they are very pretty. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And then we have we can't do anything without Stephanie. <laughs> Hello, I'm Stephanie. Got right. by Stephanie. <laughs> and and uh, we've uh, pretty much wiped Stephanie out with her fabric. So um, if you want any more of her fabrics, you got to find them on our website. <laughs> 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 Everyone had fun picking and choosing the colors, and of course. Uh, they're like, oh, Gary, does this go good with this? Gary, does that go with that? <laughs> Even I was like, Gary, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> and so it's, it's been a really blast, and we are so thankful, and we are so blessed. And we want to thank all of the uh, 90 attendees personally. We've hugged every one of them multiple times. <laughs> You're a good sport, Gary. You are a good sport. Take one for the team, Gary. I, I, I'm really getting good at hugging. I got the three tap room. One, two, three, let go. <laughs> tap them out. Yep. Tap them out. So, um, and we will be doing Stitching in the Wild next year. Yay! Yay! It's been a great success, and we've, uh, I, I survived it and have a heart attack. <laughs> now I'm addicted. So. Now I'm addicted. And so it will be in Alabama next year, and um, more to come in the coming months. We'll let you know. Perfect. So, um, anything you guys want to talk about? I would like to encourage you next year to come because this is has been a fabulous retreat. Gary and I know how to set up a shop. It is so convenient. Everything you need is right there together. They put a lot of work into it. And so I think in addition to a great fun time of stitching, uh, it's a wonderful opportunity to visit their Needle workshop. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you. Honestly, I've not laughed this much ever <laughs> in a single weekend. I'm like, I've been laughing nonstop. So it's been really great. It's been really fun. It's been fun. Yeah. And you said we have a lot of first time attendees. There's a lot of first time yes. attendees who's not been to retreats. Around 50% are the attendees. Around 15% of the attendees are first time oh, and wow. retreat. That's, That's great. great. That's and great. we are very, very blessed with the yeah. uh, and your first and one left international because you did have international. Yes, yeah. international. Yes. We oh, have uh, Central America representing Costa Rica. Yeah. <laughs> we and have the, the uh, Europe so representing yeah. um, the Netherlands. Yes. Netherlands yes. yes. And once we announced um, last night that we were going to do it again next year, there were so many people scanning their phones to see how to get flights to, to where we're going to do it at. So it was like, okay, I think they're really hooked. <laughs> so, yes, it will be in Alabama. <laughs> yeah. The, the retreat was a very successful because the people who are in the retreat. Yes. Everybody is very kind, lovely. Um, they're enjoying themselves and then let their roommates Mm -hmm. Enjoying themselves, and we actually had a lot yeah. of finishes. Not for me. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that yeah. I, 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 I actually, it took me four days. I actually finished my little cat. <laughs> <laughs> we we had the freebie from the designers, and a lot of the attendees stitch it mm -hmm. yeah. because if you please hand out these two, 
This is the Bulgari cover and paper. <laughs> <laughs> this is uh, from uh, Prestigious. Stitchy Pros. Uh, Stitchy Pros, I'm sorry. Nervous. She's right here. <laughs> yeah, we'll pop, we'll pop in bigger pictures because we are yes. a little bit out so we can get and, the full scan of the room. Yes. And um, they are stitching the freebies mm -hmm. because they see it and they see it's beautiful. So there's no black and white paper, mm -hmm. and that yeah. that was our goal to everybody appreciating the designers who take the time to give us a beautiful charts right. for free. Now yeah. the B pattern. There were two attendees who started it at the retreat and finished it mm -hmm. at the retreat. And ring the bell and ring the bell. Yeah. Yes. And then and they stitched it on Stephanie's lovely fabrics. Oh, yes. They stitched it on lilac. And we have one, uh, this one, I did not, we did not stitch it. This was the pattern that Rami's Creations designed for us. And I'll pop the picture in here. Yes. And this is Stitching in the Wild. And we, we had the thread packs for everyone. So it was really fun pattern. <laughs> and what we're going to do is we will have uh, the freebies kitted up with the floss. So we will not be selling the freebies. We will be selling the floss packs and you'll get the freebie in the floss pack until the floss packs are gone. And then we have the uh, Fox and Rabbit freebie. Mm -hmm. well, it was a bomb. Yeah. <laughs> all, all the freebies really was a bomb because people stitched all the freebies. Mm -hmm. No, it's the, oh, I like this one, I like that one. No, you go in the tables and you see somebody, a um, couple of people stitching the, mm -hmm. the um, Fox and Rabbit or stitching the other ones. Was, I was very, very blessed to see yes. the our attendees love it, the, yeah. the freebies. Yeah, and, and um, this one is um, Come Party with Frank, <laughs> and he is a very fun guy. <laughs> I, I love the thread that we picked out for, that I worked with Karen and picked out. It's called Creepin, Creeping Jenny, and I think that's the perfect cocktail name. <laughs> <laughs> so, and then are two um, exclusive designs that were covered up that we will show here. This is from Teresa Kogut, and I will pop the name in below so that you guys can see the things. This one I actually stitched the model for, and there were quite a few people who bought the kit from us, mm -hmm. and have I, there's at least 10 that started it. So yes. um, yeah. that's really good. So that means the patterns are great. People could not wait to start them. And then our last exclusive is from Teresa, is from Tracy from Ink Circles. And this one right here is a very fun one from the beach. Um, and I know there might be someone sitting here who started it. <laughs> so Stephanie even started it. And there were a couple of people who started it on the call for fabric. And then there's a couple who pulled their own fabrics like blue and green. I did, I did a sea foam. Yep. And uh, those were some really pretty colors, and I think the pattern really lends itself to be changed to any kind of pat color of fabric you want. So don't let the peach um, hold you back. Um, it looks perfect on blue and green, and any other, or even a, probably a neutral. Mm -hmm. Will those be available for people that? Uh, these two exclusive charts are exclusive to Garon Stitchery, and we will have them in the website when we get back home. Okay. Okay, good. And once they're, but once they're gone from the website, then they'll be, um, then the, we'll have to wait for the designer to fully release them on their schedule. Okay. So, I think this is going to be a great new adventure for us. And uh, I'm actually, you know what? I see everyone as family members, not really as attendees. Mm -hmm. So it's nice to get the family together. That was great. That's wow. like a reunion. Yes, it's a reunion. So that's all we're going to put in this little part, and Ronnie and I will be doing a full video when we get back home. Awesome. Thank, thank you. Guys you. So oh, thank you. 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 Thank you.